picture, but sometimes the two... Hello? Okay. That is pleasantly surprising. This is a strange and unprecedented one indeed. Sometimes the law is compatible with human nature, but sometimes the two conflict. Balancing the two is a discipline in its own right. Okay, shall we do this? The case before us is a strange and okay. unprecedented. Uh, my resin is capped, so before I say hello and everything, let us really quick take care of that and then we'll do all the lovely introductions. <clears throat> yeah, not gonna lie, I wanted to do this before I started streaming because I think it's kind of embarrassing how I take two, two, uh, what's it called? Two rotations with this team. We're not gonna talk about that. I don't have, I don't have the capacity to think about this right now. Um, what we actually need to think about is starting the limited event that we haven't done yet and that is ending in uh, uh, 
No, that's the wrong image. Uh, this is the this is the right one. <laughs> you know, eight hours to go. That's fine. We're fine here. We have enough time, right? <laughs> we do. The question is only how long can I power through? Um, we'll see, I guess. Um, you know, I'm not. I'm not gonna. I don't. I don't think I'm gonna do dailies right now. I think I'm gonna gonna start right away with a quest because I cannot I uh I I, I want to get this off of my shoulders it's kind of stressing me out not gonna lie uh let's just teleport somewhere into the chasm okay um I think I want Chi Chi for this event quest. I don't know why. I've been missing Chi Chi a little. I've been thinking of just using the characters that what appear in the quest that I also own, which literally are just uh, Yan Fei and uh, the Traveler, who probably should be in the first slot because they're the main character. Um, but then I decided I don't hate myself and also we have eight hours to complete this so <laughs> there's not we don't we don't have time for this right now we need to get serious i suppose i'll remind you again the law can be both a help and a hindrance okay let's get this going then Shall we? Are the commissions and email? Oh, there are in Azuma. We're gonna ignore those for now. <laughs> Let's start with this quest. Wait. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> Heart attack for a second. I thought we could do it and that I had to finish another prerequisite quest. Oh my god. <laughs> Someone? Hello? The disrespect? That's not someone. That's Yenfei. That's the best legal expert in all of Liwe. Probably in all of Tizat. Hello, Yenfei. Oh, traveler and Paimon? I didn't expect to see you two here. I did, and I didn't expect to see you here too, Yenfei. I mean, Fei Fei. Shouldn't you be at work in Liwe Harbor? What are you doing out in the middle of nowhere? <laughs> no, she did not just ask her if she should be at work. What? what? That's a little rude, Paimon. To be perfectly honest, this case is a little out of the ordinary. In fact, this is the first time I've ever witnessed the bottom of the chasm. Oh, but before I forget, could you do me a favor, please? If anyone happens to ask about me or my present whereabouts, just tell them you haven't seen me. I got you, girl. Huh? What are you talking about? Yenfei, you didn't do something illegal, did you? No, no, it's not like that. Look, it's quite a long story. So if you could, please just cover for me. I'll see you later. Wait, no! Don't go! What? No. No, no, no. Hello? Hey! And there she goes. She just got what here. What that was that all about? <laughs> I'm starting to feel nervous all of a sudden. Ugh, do you think she did something illegal and now she's gone into hiding here? <laughs> or maybe something super scary happened. What is what is up with Paimon today? I feel like she's channeling my energy. Paimon, I need you to, to stay somewhat calm. Yeah, I doubt it. Yanfei's a legal advisor, after all. Don't be so naive. The world is complicated these days, you know. We should be prepared for the worst. If something really did happen, we might find ourselves becoming our accomplices. Oh my god. Dramatic much? Oh, what a dilemma. Should we really cover for her? Uh, Paimon, you're the one that's both na naive and compl complicated. <laughs> Me reading again. <gasps> oh, hey guys! Hey, you oh, by there. the way, also. Yeah, you. Hey guys, to those who joined just now. Hello, hello. What are you doing here? What? Someone's coming? Someone? <laughs> but 
very familiar. Mm hmm. It's ah, Cookie. <laughs> it's you two. So, uh, what are you two doing in a place like this, huh? Wait, don't tell me. Hmm. You're on vacation. Hey, boo dude. It's the one and only eight. Oh, I can't believe they're making me say that. I must it's say, uh, you two are looking guy. pretty good. Things been going your way lately? Because I have been doing amazing. <laughs> I, for one, appreciate Max Middleman's performance. Uh, Thank you very much. Nico? Who's that behind you? I have people who joined and finally we're meeting her. Hey there. I'm with the Arataki gang. Kuki Shinobu. Nice to meet you. Whoa, that voice! Oh, all right. I almost forgot she was back there. Let me introduce you to Shinobu, the pride and joy of the Arataki gang. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, another member of Iko's gang! Let me tell you, she's one of Hanamizaka's best and brightest, so of course she's in the gang. Shinobu takes care of practically everything in the Arataki gang. She can protect you guys too, you know? Mm, I like her. A friend of the fox <laughs> is a friend of mine. You must be the traveler in Paima. She sounds a lot older than what I imagined, but I really like it. It makes a lot of sense. Yep, yep. Nice to meet you too, Shinobu. Yeah, hey. Hey, hey, Koki. The pleasure's mine. I have a feeling that we'll be working together soon enough. I like her. So, uh, Ito, if she's the one that takes care of everything in the gang, then doesn't that kind of make her the gang's real boss? Oh, for sure. <laughs> Are you kidding? Of course I'm the boss. To the four corners of Kazat, there is only one boss of Hanamizaka's legendary Arataki gang, a me. I feel like you're the face of the Arataki gang, which would make you more like a prime minister. And, you know, she's the president. She actually runs the whole ship, so... You can be the... the... Wait, what did I just say? Oh my god, political systems are confusing when you live in multiple countries and they all have their own systems. You're like the... Oh my god. <laughs> Let's move on. This is embarrassing. Okay. <laughs> Hi, gets the dynamic now. A useless boss with an ultra-capable subordinate. Hey, you... Uh, you know what? Forget it. The average person couldn't possibly understand the dynamics of the Arataki gang. Yeah, I just tried leader, and miserably failed. I can't failed. let myself stoop down to your level. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> anyway... Have you seen a pink-haired legal uh, <gasps> I mean, I mean. lady? Where's a goofy <clears throat> hat, knows everything, kind of short. Where's a goofy hat, knows everything, kind of short. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen her. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> her name's Yenfei. Aww. She's a legal advisor from Liyue. I thought perhaps you two would know her. Oh, no. Oh, we know her, we all right. We have seen her. I mean. We don't know this person at all. <laughs> Damn, my, my, my impulse to say, yes, I know Yenfei, I like Yenfei, <laughs> betrayed Yenfei in the end, so I'm glad they couldn't hear me just now. Okay, um, yeah, Paimon, might as well just admit that we know her. Aha, so you have seen her. Oh, god dang, they're on to us. Uh, no, who gave you that idea? Paimon didn't say anything. That is why Paimon should talk less, because this always happens. This always, always happens. Oh, look at you getting all antsy. Ha, seems I was able to get to the truth after all. <laughs> She's so smug. When someone is lying, their eyes often start wandering subconsciously. <laughs> anyway, don't worry. I assure you we don't have any ill intentions. So, uh, you guys know Yanfei? Well, she, uh, kind of saved my life, <gasps> so... Yeah, you could say we've met. Oh my god, it's passed on! Like, Yula saved Yenfei's life, and now Yenfei is saving Ito's life. That's the Claymore Catalyst cycle, I suppose. Ito shall save... Miko's life, maybe? He saved your life? Wait, hold on. What are you two doing in the chasm anyway? Yeah, sorry, Paimon can be a bit slow sometimes. You know that the Sakoku decree has been lifted recently in Inazuma, right? Well, Shinobu wanted to come to Liyue and pick up her graduation certificate. I came along because it's safer to travel in numbers. Graduation certificate? Did you study in Liyue? Yes. I studied law at the Tonglin Academy in Liyue. <gasps> Unfortunately, That's so cool. The Sakoku decree was implemented just when I was home visiting my family before graduation. So I'm a few years late getting my graduation certificate. That actually sounds a lot that, like the situations we've been having... <laughs> In our world too, like with the pandemic and now 
the am I allowed to talk about such things on stream? The war going on in Europe. Uh, we were taking care of some errands in Liu, and the boss got tangled up with some millilith while we were standing in a line. He was about to get arrested when, luckily, Yenbei happened to be walking past and helped us out. Yep. If it wasn't for her, our trip to Liyue would have ended with me in the slammer. <laughs> so, you know, I just wanted to do something nice to show my heartfelt gratitude. That is so cool. But she said she didn't need my help with anything. I thought there's a chance she might run into trouble here on her own, so I followed her here. Yeah, just in case she needs me to come leaping to her rescue. Oh my god, Ito, stop. <laughs> So you're forcing her to accept your help, basically. What? No, it's not like that at all. Look, I, I just wanted to protect her, okay? She looked like she was in a hurry, so I thought she must be out doing something important. Okay, I don't know what things are like in Tevat, but in our world, when, you know, men start to follow women, that's People usually not a good idea. Like that. World dealing with Even if you business, want to help, guys, you know? don't I'm do just, it. Just being considerate, really. Don't run after legal advisors who can clearly take care of themselves uh yeah traveler is shinobo trying to hint at something that way maybe she's hinting for me to distract ito wow that is so smart uh yenfei went that way for sure actually mm -hmm. ah great thanks i'll go after her shinobu time to roll you're not my savior. Ito's coming to your rescue. Appreciate the help. Until next time. Uh, Traveler, did you just send Ito the wrong way on purpose? Huh. Shinobu seems pretty sharp. Paimon doesn't think you can pull one on her like that. Or maybe she knows that Ito can be a big nuisance, so she's trying to stop him from bothering Yanfei. Oh, well, at least this way nobody will be bothering Yanfei. If we run into her again later, we should let her know that we helped her out. Yeah, we got her back, all right. Hmm. All right. Now let's go take a look at the crash site from last time. Phew. Okay. I have to admit, I was not motivated whatsoever to do this quest because I didn't want to rush it. Um, I didn't want to rush exploring the chasm, which I had to yesterday. But now that we started it, I'm obviously very happy. This was great. she is! Look! is here too! Hey, Yanfei! We sent away the people that were following you. Oh, good. Thanks a lot. The guy with the weird outfit seemed super outgoing. Normally, I don't mind making friends, but I've got work to do today. Huh? So what kind of work are you doing in a place like this? Aw, oh, don't tell Paimon you're thinking about becoming an adventurer too! Well, as a legal advisor, sometimes I also have to travel in person. I came to the chasm to deal with a will. Oh. Uh, a will? That's right. I found a will inside an old book. I'm guessing it was left by someone of great importance. It appears he lost a magical device and wished to retrieve it. Wait, I need to read that again. A will in, uh, inside of an old book? From great importance? Magical device that he wanted to find, get back. Okay. Legal advisors have to deal with that kind of thing. Huh, what a job! Will execution is also part of my work as a legal advisor. <laughs> of course, cases like this are quite rare. The chasm is not the kind of place you can just waltz into whenever you want. I love how vague they're keeping her job as a legal advisor. <laughs> like, mm, oh. yeah. So you do know what kind <gasps> of place this is. I thought I might find you here. Yeah, that's a nice uh, way to make an entrance. Hee hee hee. Whatever case you're working on in the chasm, I'm sure Liyue's top legal consultant can handle it without my input. <laughs> that's funny. I thought we'd established that my legal opinion doesn't count for anything when Yelon's around. <gasps> 
Oh, wait, I did not know that tidbit of information. They have a, a, at least some banter going on here. Uh, who is she? This is Yelon. Leo is, uh, well, let's just say she works in the Ministry of Civil Affairs. I can at least say that much, right? Anyway, she's a friend of mine. Sure. Coincidentally, I have something to do here as well. Seems chance has brought us all together. What what does sure mean in this case? What does what do you mean by that, Yelan? You may not know me, traveler in Paimon, but I've certainly heard about you. Oh really? I guess I do have many friends in Liyue. If you're all here on business, then it's my job to monitor the chasm. According to regulations, I should accompany you. But as it turns out, I have other things that require my attention. I'm afraid I can't join you this time. You may go about your business. Just try not to make a ruckus. Why did I never notice her, like, purple makeup? That was amazing. Oh, that's most unfortunate. I was about to ask for your assistance. Could you spare a little time to help me take care of this will? For old time's sake? What is going on between them? Hmm, I don't know. Depends what's in it for me. Fair enough, I suppose even a guide needs to get paid. It just so happens that Madame Ping gave me some nice tea. I'll treat you to a cup if you agree. Ooh. <laughs> Why don't you tell me a little more about how you got here first? Then I'll... Hey, you! Oh no. Not the... no. Uh, Yiko? What is he doing back here? Uh-oh. I know what you two did! Oh god. You really tried to throw me off, didn't you? <laughs> And I thought we were great. Look, I like Itzo, don't get me wrong, but if there's one thing I can't stand is when a couple of girls are having a moment and then they get interrupted by a loud, sometimes a little obnoxious guy. Well, yeah, calm down, dude, they're also my friends. That's close enough. Ooh, I like that. Huh? Who are you? Sorry, this area is part of the chasm. It's closed to the general public. Are you kidding me? I, I, I don't see any warning signs or fences. <laughs> what gives you the right to keep me out? Kid, where there's real danger, you'll never see a warning sign. Uh, Paimon never knew this place was so important. It really is an unusual it's place, true. huh? This is not a place you can just go in and out of as you wish. That's also why I didn't want anyone to follow me. Unfortunately, you didn't listen. The Traveler has done a lot for Liyue in the past. And Yenfei is a renowned legal consultant in Liyue, so I can trust their intentions. As for you two... Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You're trying to say that I'm not famous enough and my intentions are no good? I don't know your background, so I can't give you free passage here. Besides, Yenfei doesn't seem to need your help, does she? Ha! How would you know what Yenfei needs? What, are you two joined at the hip or something? <clears throat> They're insinuating a lot. Subtextually, I feel. Right. <laughs> anyway, I don't need to be a mind reader to see that. In any case, as a visitor from Inazuma, I'd suggest you defer to a local when in doubt. Stick to the local rules and keep yourself out of trouble. <coughs> Why, you? You know, I hate, I have, I don't know if I hate to say it, but I have to agree with her. Please, try not to be so impulsive. She is right, you know. Thanks, Cookie. See, women and reason. Uh-oh. Things are starting to get a little heated here. Oh, not good. You really shouldn't start butting heads with me. <laughs> it's true that we don't know anything about the unique conditions of this place. So we'll heed your advice and leave immediately. But if this really is a dangerous area, seriously, you should put up a sign. Thanks for the suggestion. I'll consider it. Oh my god. I love, I love her sarcasm. Oh my god. Oh yeah? And what if we don't leave, hmm? Oh, don't. Boss. Then, I'm afraid things might get unpleasant. Five-star showdown, hey. Is that so? You really think you can take the two of us? Well, gotta admit, I like your optimism. Although you're what friends is going with the on right now? Yenfei, I'd still suggest you heed my warning. <laughs> Thanks for that, but uh, too bad I'm not buying it. If you're so strong, then what? You show me what no. You, you know, synergistically, I will have to say Enfei and Yelan could beat them. Hold on, boss. 
There's no need to start a fight here. Oh, no. I'm going in whether she likes it or not. <laughs> you think I was joking around, huh? Oh, no. They tore our bell to go at it. Please, wait a minute, you two. This whole thing started because of me. Why don't you just save me the embarrassment and just... Huh? Huh? Oh, Yanfei trying to save the situation. Uh oh, it's a... Ah! Also, this is peak whatever. Hey, stop trying to change the subject. I'm gonna... Uh, 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 huh? Oh, 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 ah! Why did we interrupt this? Why? This could have been a great fight. I would have loved to see some ass whooping. This was peak women loving women versus men loving men iconic moment. It could have been. You know, two strong faces of the movement showing off against another. Showing down, I guess. Did we fall into this place? I don't know, we didn't really see anything. Just faded oh. to black. Ow. Putting my books under me to break the fall didn't help at all. Oh, that is so cute. <sighs> Oh, <laughs> oh, she's so sweet. Uh, I'm gonna feel that in the morning. Uh, hey, Shinobu, Traveler, and my savior. Is everyone okay? My savior. Oh, <laughs> okay, that's kind of cute. <laughs> well, this <laughs> is an unfortunate turn of events. Hey, so, uh, how far down did we fall? Hmm. It seems the ground collapsed during our little confrontation up there. Perhaps because we triggered the elemental forces. Oh, don't look at me. If you weren't so rude, maybe I wouldn't have gotten mad. <laughs> Who can put up with that kind of dude? Oh my god. It's, it's my duty to stop intruders from breaking into important places. If telling the truth sounds rude, then I'm afraid you're <gasps> just a little too fragile. Shots fired! Shots fired! Hey, life's too <gasps> short to give in all the time. Oh, that was ruthless. Ooh. Boss, I'm afraid you're not going to win this argument. I suggest we stop provoking her. That's a good suggestion. Wait. Kuki said she studied to be a lawyer, right? She should know Yenfei. Shouldn't they have, like, she studied, she literally studied to be a lawyer in Liwei Harbor, where Yenfei is a lawyer. I feel like they should know each other. Hey, whose side are you on here? I'm simply pointing out the facts. I understand how you feel. But you're making my life difficult by starting random fights with everyone. <laughs> Looks like Ito can't argue against either Yeon or Shinobu. He's in a real tough spot now. Yeah, Ito's really good with getting along with people, but when he doesn't get along with people, he kind of fails. Uh, hey! What do you mean? Don't you dare compare Paimon to Ito! Uh, we all thought it. Come on, admit it. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> what do you mean? Looking for a fight too? <laughs> Did Ito eat some beans or something? Why is he so t like? Why is he like this right now? Paimon was just saying how it is. Everyone knows you're a bit of an idiot. <gasps> okay. You calling me? Oh, I know what's going on. Oh, yeah? oh well, my god, a, I am stupid. You need little flying lavender melon. Ha! I think I'm stupid. It's clearly the chasm is affecting them, right? The whateverness of the whateverness that made the Miss G cough so much. The black purple thing. I think that's what's affecting them and making them so hostile towards one another and arguing and all of that. And I feel like Yanfei knows from the looks of it. Flying lavender melon! Oh, that's it! There, oh, she's gonna say something. Time to give you an ugly nickname! Uh, bull chucker! Mm. You better mind your manners, bull chucker! We seem to be a long way down from where we fell. Oh. It's impossible to see what's going on up above. <sighs> it's unlikely we'll be able to climb back up that far. We'll need to find another way. Use your ropes, Yelen. Throw them, and then pull Yanfei up with them. I'm sorry to interrupt your lovely little chat here, but I think there's something you may need to know. The chasm is regarded as a mysterious area in Liyue. It was sealed off for years due to a mining accident. Whatever goes on down here... I suggest you remember this. You didn't see anything, you didn't hear anything, and you're not gonna ask any questions. Save you from getting caught up in things you shouldn't know about. Oh my god. Oh 
Oh my god. I won't treat you as hostiles. And in exchange, I hope you won't make things difficult when it comes to keeping secrets. I'll do what I can to find a way out. <clears throat> huh? Well, where does she think she's going? Like she said, to search for an exit. Chances are that Yelan is the best among us at survival and handling emergencies. We should just let her go. I'm afraid I must apologize. I don't typically disclose details of a client's will to third parties, which is why I couldn't tell you the truth. <sighs> I'm sorry. It's not your fault, babe. You're not the one who intruded in a place where you were where you weren't supposed to be. I came to the chasm in search of the fantastic compass, which is mentioned in the will. Many years ago, my client gave this magical device to someone ambitious, hoping that it'd be handy in times of need. Fantastic compass? Hmm. To someone ambitious, hoping that According to an eyewitness account, the person who received the device took it into the chasm and has been missing ever since. Hmm. Throughout history, many wars have been fought in the vicinity of the chasm. Even if that person died in one of the wars, I still wish to do my utmost and find the device and fulfill the client's wish. Yelan's words of caution were not unwarranted. There are dangers lurking in the chasm. I'm sure you've all realized that by now. Given that we're all caught in this mess, Let's try to find a way out together. See, this is why I like Yinfei. She cares, and she's reasonable, and she's responsible, and she's friendly, and she wants to help people, and I mean, what is there not to like? Whatever you say, my savior, I'll do whatever you ask. From now my on, savior. we're a team. All of us. God dang, you That big jerk. <laughs> and I guess that includes her, too. You think Yen oh, she's works so embarrassed for him. Civil affairs, huh? Simon can tell she's tougher than most, but... Wow, her job sounds demanding. I mean, did we hear what her job was? Well, that's what she tells outsiders. I can't disclose too much about her identity, but I'd say she's the only person who can handle this type of work. What kind of lame job would have someone go out to the middle of nowhere? Wow. Oh, I'm a nose, an adventure. <laughs> hey, what's with the face? Oh, did Paimon say something wrong? That's literally what the two of us do, isn't it? I'm the inventor of Primal, not you, okay? Uh, you're so stingy these days. <clears throat> let Paimon be an adventurer by association, okay? I agree. She can work with us. What's the problem? Yeah, she's got a point, Traveler. You're Paimon's boss. Take it from me. As a great leader, you should learn to be a little more generous. Aww. You know, let your sidekick share some of the glory. Ah, uh, retracted. <laughs> don't understand anything about us. Paimon, don't take him too seriously. He's just joking. Ugh. For the sake of Shinobu, fine. For Cookie. Hm. I'm the boss, so I'll let it slide. Okay. Hmm. I think she's caught it, ca uh, catching Perhaps this on? was another sealed location, but an undocumented one. What could be in here? I've got some food and water on me. If anyone needs some, just let me know. Aww. Great. You know, Bullchester, you may not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but your subordinate here seems super capable and reliable. <clears throat> hey, Axel. How's it going? Hi. You wanted some more Yenfei time, huh? I mean, Fei time. God dang, I really need to ingrain that. I really can't blame you. This has been superb so far. <laughs> I know. Isn't she the best? I am too a sharp tool. <laughs> there seems to be an entrance up ahead with a path inside. Wonder where it leads to. Well, let's go take a look. I feel like the Genshin cutscenes have been very differently lately. Like, there's been a lot of dialogue, but it's been more dynamic and more interesting. It's probably because there are characters involved that we care about. <laughs> Anyways, I feel like they're stepping up their game, Who so good for them. Who would we'd find and a domain us. entrance in a place like this? Yeah, I'm fine too, thanks. Uh. There's a way in, and there's a way out. Let's go and take a look. The rocks here seem to be old Leela <laughs> mountain rocks. They're similar to what I've seen in books. This domain must have existed for quite some time now. 
<laughs> What's that sound? <gasps> Shout! It's you, dot 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 exclamation mark. Oh, oh, it's Shell. Conqueror of demons? What are you doing here? <gasps> Whoa, what is that? Oh, uh, I came down from above. Uh, I heard a noise, so I followed it here. So you're not here by accident. Hmm. Wanna team up? No, I have something else <laughs> to do. That is so out of character for you, my guy. You don't want to spend time with a group of people? Is it something or I'm something important? Someone. You're looking for someone. Oh, I know who you're looking for, I think. Say and yay together. Uh, yell together. Axel do be feeling pretty blessed right now. I'm feeling that. We're, we're channeling these vibes because absolutely. You shouldn't be here. I would urge like they're you to standing together even. Possible. That's a normal reaction to have, right? <laughs> Oof. Poof. Well, that's show for you. Yeah. Goes up without a warning and disappears without a trace. Ooh, I'm curious to see how he and Ito will get along. That is an interesting clash of characters, huh. I think. Personality. That guy looks pretty tough. Maybe almost as tough as me. Oh my god. Seems like a solid dude. Seriously, bone checker? Where do you get your confidence from? Should we really be letting him go off on his own? Yeah, he'll he'll be fine. Oh, he wouldn't listen no matter how much you tried to talk him out of it. He is super tough though, so don't worry about him. But like back to Yellen and Yenfei, the important characters of this quest. I have so many questions right now. Everyone, I'm very keep intrigued. your eyes and ears peeled from mm -hmm. here on out. We don't know what lies ahead, so we have to be ready for anything. Oh, look, I'm happy to say we're all on the same team and everything, but uh, could you cut the little speeches and the whole oh my god act? I, for one, think I should be able to look after myself. No, like, I really liked Ido from his story quest. I really, really did. But this was a little much, Boss. my guy. Yeah, exactly. Ugh, okay, okay. Besides, you're the one who's just looking out for everyone. You know, Bullchucker, you're a guest here, so maybe try to get along with everyone. Ha! Please, you're not a local either, Flying Lavender Melon. So stop trying to sound like one. Are they gonna invent more and more nicknames coming up? You know, I wouldn't mind that. Bullchucker is kind of a good one. <clears throat> Enter the domain. Ooh, I don't know if my team's ready for such a thing. Hi, Joe. We got Mona. No yell on, unfortunately. <gasps> Trial? Trial character, maybe? Ito's funny, but he gets on your nerves sometimes. Yeah, I'm. Th yeah, that's pretty much what. It, uh, what? <clears throat> I agree. Well, I mean, he's a good dude. He has a good heart. Unique to Lila. Place is actually pretty cool. If we weren't in such a hurry to get out, we could kick back um. and enjoy the scenery a little. Oh, okay. Delved into guys, opening box of Adept Eitrix. Where are you? Oh, this team is crap, by the way. Don't ignore what I'm doing right now. This is... You know, Traveler and Yanfei had to be here for obvious reasons. I don't know why I've been missing Chi Chi and Mona's just here because Hydro and Yanfei is good, generally speaking. And I prefer Mona over Sinkcha, so <laughs> there we go. That is this very broken, broken team. Ugh. This in turn reminds Jaime of the Adepti domains we've been to before. Could there be an Adeptus here? Okay, but we just rotated a city that was upside down. Can one do the same thing to the city within the chasm that is upside down? Or is that not connected at all? That music was so cool. Life goes on. Written in the stars. Oh, I have some very good news to share that Sakura Petals already know knows. I got a good crit rate hat for Yenfei, finally. I mean good when I say good, I mean better than what I had before. So 
I'm just so proud. So proud. If you are wondering, Isla, how's this good? You'll maybe understand how bad my other one was. <clears throat> my greatest weakness. Orientation. Walking through labyrinths. I don't know where I need to go. I probably need to rotate this. Oh my god, that music is so cool. I feel like this is a lot. <clears throat> Not gonna lie, this is, was a little why I felt pressed to do the quest because I had a feeling that some mechanic would would pop up that would just uh, take me some time to understand. Okay, so that cube, oh wait. I know what we have to do, I think. Mmm, big brain. You need to flip it upside down. Please? Yes, oh my god. Oh, no, no, that's not gonna work. <laughs> ah, her greatest weakness. Bunch of slime. Orders given. Orders received. Oh, yes, I'm very glad I... I... oops. I bullied myself into doing this. I am very, very, very happy. Have I drum the drum event? No. <laughs> look, look at this. Drum event, 14 days. Perilius Trail, seven hours. I I have to get my priorities right. But we can do it in screen as uh, on screen. We can do it on stream and scream. Not. Let's not scream. But um cool. I'm glad to hear that it was fun because it doesn't sound too exciting, to be honest. Where to now? Why do I ignore these? The ones that I unlock? Why do I just go away like... I didn't just fight enemies so I could unlock the cube. No. Uh, uh, uh. Life goes on. Oh, we seem bigger numbers today. Pyro. Oh, <laughs> I was just about to ask, why is everything Pyro in here? And then I remembered that they recommended to bring Hyjo characters. And I was like, ah, of course. Yell on playground, of course. Okay. Honestly, Chi Chi's so cute. I've been sleeping on her. It's like when you have Kokomi and Zhongli, you don't need another healer. This is great. Shadows of fate. Oh. Hey, look over there. It looks like an exit. Cool. Big chest. Love to see it. How's your your guys' day going? Mine uh, I mean, you're hearing a lot of me, so if you want to share any joyous occasions or 
devastating grievances. I'm here to listen. Wh huh? Wait. This ain't right. Uh, uh, how did we end up back here? So we've been here already? Yes, this is exactly where we started. Hmm. But we couldn't have taken a wrong turn. We were headed in the same direction the entire time. We never turned around. Yes, that's what I thought too. Traveler, we were going the right way, weren't we? Yes, I thought we were headed in the right direction too. How strange. There's a legend in Inazuma about a merchant who was tricked by a Bake Danuki one evening and kept circling around the same place the whole night. Even by dawn, they still hadn't found a way out. Yeah, Hyman's heard that one before too. So we're all familiar with the story then? Good, because I'm pretty sure that's what's happening to us right now. <laughs> Otherwise, we wouldn't have understood. If we didn't know the story before, he would probably have to explain it to us in very long detail. But fear not. I happen to have a certain sidekick who can exercise yokai and spirits and whatnot. <clears throat> Let me summon him real quick. Wait. Oh, his cow? Unbelievable. What's it called? An Oni who's friends with an exorcist? Huh. What an open-minded guy. I don't... Do the... Do the... Do the... Do the Oni count as one of the beings the yokai's exercise? No. For the boss, ignorance is a virtue. Ignorance? <laughs> You're up, Ushi. Go get this. Yeah, Ushi. Okay, I'm glad I didn't say the name that popped in my head because I was so wrong. Probably one of the best things about Ito is that he has a dancing this cow. This is Ushi, an auxiliary member of the Arataki gang. Mm. Kind of embarrassing confession. Someone in chat skipped the banter between Ito and the <laughs> no. flying imp. Ushi says hello, everyone. You can just call him Ushi or Beefcake. Yeah, he's got a keen sense of direction, so I'll let him lead the way. Hi, Ushi. I didn't know gangs could have auxiliary members. Hmm. You learn every day, Yaman. Well, so I don't know if this is... I'm doing your favor now so that you can relive it, the things that you skipped, or if you're actually in pain, because I'm not skipping dialogue. I don't do that. This I try not, not to. Have the of something that's gonna work. I hope it's the former. <laughs> you're telling me. All right. Aww. Go, Ushi. Go find us a way out of here. You know, Ito, you also could talk to the women who clearly have more expertise in this area and in general, really, when we're being honest, instead of just throwing stuff to the wall and see what sticks. Aww. Okay, but that's cute. I'll take it. <sighs> yeah, Sakura, the weather was so much better huh? today. What's Thank that? God. Oh. No way. What's wrong? What is wrong? She says he searched everywhere, but there's no exit. Hmm. I trust the cow. That doesn't add up. If we were able to come in, then there must be a way to get out. Here, let me take another look. This is how we end. Has we just start to death this? in this cave. We initially thought we fell here from above. At that time, there was a way out high overhead. But now, it seems even that exit has disappeared. Hmm. Inexplicable, if you ask me. Seems there's more than meets the eye with these underground structures. Hmm. I'm gonna take another look around. Everywhere we look, there are just more and more rats. Oh no. Uh, maybe we just misremembered. Maybe this isn't the place we started from. Or the walls are closing what? in. You scared now? Oh. <laughs> no. Paimon's super brave. Wait, you skipped this? Amazing dialogue? Really? Oh, yeah? Well, uh, Ushi also thinks you're scared. <laughs> okay. Don't oh be scared God. to admit you're, uh, <laughs> scared. Yeah. You got us here to protect you. You sure, Ido, that it's okay to admit that? You want to admit something yourself? Ah, uh, finally we're being supportive. I'm here for you we too, Paimon. We can't just sit here twiddling our thumbs. Let's keep looking for a way out. <gasps> Shinobu, you stay here with my precious savior. I'll take the traveler and Paimon with me. I love the circle. <laughs> got it. Be careful, everyone. Please, there's no need to keep calling me savior. Just uh, Yensei is fine. I liked Mr. it, though. <laughs> it seems that as the head of the Arataki gang, you 
possess a strong sense of leadership. Ah, too kind, too kind. And just call me Ito. Since we're a team now, we should have each other's backs. Uh, Paimon, if you feel scared again, I can cover your eyes for you. Oh, <laughs> uh, I guess. <laughs> Real quick though, I can. I think I'm starting to see why you feel motivated to pull an Ito's banner, Axel. If Yenfei and he gets get along, pretty all right, I'd say. Seems there's really no way out. Oh, no issue for for being late. Sorry, I'm reading chat right now. It's all good. We're just chilling. I'm I guess I'm. I would say I'm sorry we started already, but I'm also not, because we have six hours left or so. <laughs> I can't shake the feeling that there's something off about this place. Wow, he's so perceptive, my guys. Boss, did you guys find anything over there? No, nothing. Not only that, this I is what I mean. I saw some shadows moving a second. This ago. is exactly what I mean. Re normally, I'm sorry that I'm talking over you, Ito. I'm just having a revelation. Normally, they would make us look. In places and like the cutscene would end we would have to walk 10 meters to the left look at a glowing glow gold thing pick it up have paimon say something observe the thing go 20 meters to the right and do the same thing you get it you play through it they're not doing that in this quest and i think it's better because the characters themselves are so dynamic that it's better to not be disrupted out of it probably not the right time to ask this but paimon just can't help it ito you're an oni doesn't that kind of mean everywhere you go is haunted? No, ignore the red horns, okay? I, I'm talking about spooky, floaty ghosts. Now you see them, now you don't count a haunted. Uh, any smart person want to explain to me why it would be haunted wherever he goes as an Oni? I don't remember the lore saying such a thing. Uh, Ito, are you afraid of ghosts? <laughs> I don't know, boss. See if I found out. The list grows. What's me? What? No way! First what thing you do? <laughs> Stop joking around. <laughs> Looking at you, Paimon suddenly doesn't feel scared anymore. Hey, Bolt Chucker, if you're scared, Paimon can cover your eyes for you. Uh, maybe I should make better use of my time. Now she's thinking of it. After spending years with him, now she's coming to whatever. <laughs> She never worked off uh, ugh, breathing. Three octagons. Mm -hmm. She never walked off to grab a few stones. Then she took out some twigs and lavender melons from her pocket. What is going on? Some salt and some pepper. Are you roasting lavender melons right now? Yeah, roasted lavender melon is delicious. You can try some when it's done. She's a keeper. Oh right. There are two types, sweet and savory. Which would you prefer? Hello? Deluxe cuisine? Uh, I'm happy with All either. Alright, you can try them both then. Aww. It's important that we remain calm, especially when we're in the throes of a tough situation like this. If I'm reading the situation correctly, there seems to be some secret here that the boss and I are not supposed to know about. Don't worry, I'll distract the boss while you discuss <gasps> things with the others. Guys, she's such a team player. Oh, I thought I smelled something cooking. <laughs> Would you like some Yenfei? And they're so thank you, yeah, but I'm not hungry. You guys go ahead. I'm 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 slowly falling into gushing mode. Oh, just a fair warning. Way, I haven't seen you in a while, Shinobu. <gasps> I called it. I said yeah, it. It has been a while, <laughs> hasn't it? The last time I saw you was when you taught one of my classes as a substitute while I was studying in Liyue. Mm-hmm. Big brain. Substitute teacher? Ah, yes. Now I remember. It was during winter, wasn't it? Yes, I remember everyone said your lecture was very interesting. Now that I think about it, I should call you senpai. Ooh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> Who would have ever guessed that we'd get caught up in such a dilemma together? It must be fate. So, Yanfei gives lectures too? That's incredible. I like what you're saying, Lumine. Not only that, she's funny and engaging while she speaks. Needless to say... She's very popular among the students. Guys. Guys. Sorry. I have to. Guys. <laughs> oh, I'm flattered. <sighs> I see everyone is still here. Hey, babe. 
let me read chat real quick. Um, I'm keeping butt chucker. Sorry. What's a bull chucker? Butt chucker is much better. I'm glad you made that typo. Ito is trying his best, you guess. Sakura pedals. I, yeah. Yeah. I guess. He is. We all, um, I think that's a mantra that plays over and over in Cookie's head. She's like, Ito's trying his best. He's just trying his best. Ito, he's just trying his best. <laughs> well, like, you know, houses burn down behind them and she needs to get him out of jail and whatever else trouble they get into. Ito and Paimon are such a vibe. You love their banter. You okay? <laughs> you have some aggression that needs to come out. No, you're right. It's it's all in good fun, right? Game I on. suppose it is. We split into groups and searched the area, but there are no signs of any way out. How about you? Did you manage to find anything? That's a very cool shot, by the way. The three on the right and the other three on the left. <laughs> and the cow that's wiggling its butt. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to again. I can't. <laughs> no. <laughs> what? And though I'd prefer not to say it, we'd better mentally prepare <clears throat> ourselves. Oh, yeah. If we can't find a way out, we may be stuck underground for some time. Yeah, some time. Let's stay optimistic. <sighs> I think you might be right. I want her as my teacher too, Axel. I feel like I would learn a lot. I'm serious. I understand. Uh, hmm. An underground space with an entrance but no exit. It just doesn't make any sense. I'll figure something out. Just give me some time. Yeah, we're, we're surrounded by, well, mostly surrounded by a room of very intelligent you know actually we are surrounded by very intelligent women so we should be able to get out if here. anyone happens to find a potential exit please be sure to take every precaution before exploring further come to think of it if, uh, whoa, whoa. what is going on why can't i read today Xiao is here too he said that we can always call him if we get into trouble yeah we should have asked him. He knows everything about this place. He should at least. Maybe it's worth a try. Hey, traveler, what's with the serious face? Do you have a plan? Well, I was just thinking that Cheryl was also here. And even if he weren't, you know, canon is we call his name, he appears. No matter what. Cheryl! Oh, right! Do you want to get in to help us? Yeah, I think it's worth sure. a try. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> dot 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 Xiao <sighs> Dot 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 Uh Xiao <gasps> No Huh Well it's fine Pine on that Xiao would come no matter where we are That's what I said oh, That's no. what I thought that mean even Xiao can't sense our presence here not good. <clears throat> dot dot dot. Let me change my study loss just so you can see him. Axel. Is it worth it? Is it worth it really? <laughs> you know, maybe it will. Maybe it is. You'll do it. Yeah. I'll watch you. I'll watch you do it. And I'll be cheering and admiring for sure. Because, oh my god, law is tough. Maybe. No, it, 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 I imagine it to be tough as well in Tevat. Especially in Peibat, with all their freaky things going on there. Wonder what that could mean. That Chow's missing, by the way. What's the deal with this place? Now you're asking, Wumi. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I was confused why Enfei was standing here all of a sudden. Okay, dude, let's get it over with. What do you want? That's it. I want to take another look. And this time, I, Arataki, uh, the one and only, will... Uh, Fuck. <sighs> Whoa, whoa, what's up, sourpuss? What? Time for some roasted lavender melon. <laughs> huh? We're, we're trapped in a life and death situation underground, and you're telling me it's time for roasted lavender melon? Yeah, dude, listen to him. Interesting. You hear that? Ushi says you're completely right. Wait, hold on. Whose side are you on, beefcake? Beefcake. Wait, no, wasn't his... I already forgot. What did you say, but... But it's Chucker? important to stay replenished. We must keep our energy and morale up in preparation for facing the unknown. 
Even Ushi knows that. Fine, you two are... Hey, are you already eating? Oh, hold on, <laughs> is it still warm? Oh, oh, that does smell good. All right, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just, we'll have a quick snack, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll keep looking for a way out. Hey, don't eat them all, leave a couple for me! You know, at least he's easily subdued. <clears throat> hey, girl! Girl! Hmm. Who could have ever guessed we'd get trapped in a place like this? It's quite the predicament. For all the studying I've done in my life, all I know is how to land people in prison. Wait, what? I don't know the first thing about breaking out of one. <laughs> well, that's a way to frame your law, your your years and years of practicing and learning and studying law. I've even made a contract with my father to live a happy life. I can't give up hope now. Try and stay positive. At least I've explored a new place and seen more of the world while reuniting with some old friends. <laughs> yeah, Aww. there's still a silver lining, I guess. Don't be sad. Be happy. We're here. You should be happy. Anyways, I felt like Yenfei from the beginning sounded very like sad and somber. I wonder if it's just because or if there's another reason to it. She was very serious. Our situation is grim. There doesn't appear to be a way out for now. We should be prepared to stay for a while. Fortunately, we don't seem to lack supplies, and even our motley crew has people who can keep their cool when the stakes are high. Just focus on taking care of yourselves. I'll figure out the rest. Interact with the mysterious Windborn in a specific place to visit the realms of heal and war and take part in the combat challenge. Is this the fun part? Is this what people loved? Wait till the next day. Okay, time to reach out a little. Uh, forget informatics lost away. Um, mm -hmm. if Yenfei says so, Yenfei says so, right? We can't argue with that. Also, quick thing, I really want an event with the Shogun and Yai and other Inazuma characters right now to happen like this. This is great. I'm loving the setting, this whole like characters from around, you know, very different characters with very different personalities with all their respective goals and reasons to be in a place get stuck and have to rely on one another to get out it's some great great setup so i would love to have that with like a and yai and yeah okay gushing over uh that's probably a good choice axel stay with you've already invested too much in informatics um you can learn a lot when you're free by playing Genshin with Yenfei. That's a good compromise, I feel. Pretty sure- oh, sorry. Pretty sure Yai son- uh, yeah, Yenfei son- uh, advanced in law, she'd get you sued for things that aren't even in the book yet. Um, never thought of it that way, but you know what? I believe it. I hear it, I see it, I believe it. I'm kind of- makes me not want to get on her bad side even more you want to meet the archons to meet up for an event yeah it's been due time you know what i've been uh i've been somewhat consoled by the fact that or not the fact the theory there's a theory i don't know if theory is too strong of a word there's a wish that in the end all the archons will have to team up and fight you know, the unknown god or Celestia or what have you together and it will be a big epic fight scene. That idea alone got me so excited. So yeah, I also really want to meet them. They're all such characters too. Like they're such characters. Yen, uh, oh my god, my brain. I'm really sorry. I didn't, whatever. I didn't sleep a lot tonight. A, Zhongli, and Venti, they're like I love them, but these people are a mess, <laughs> and they'd be perfect together in scenes. Oh my god, they would! They should get trapped together. That would be the funniest stuff. Hoyo should do like a animated thing, for like the fans. It would be great. What are we doing? Okay, I heard this was really fun though. So, okay, set arrangements. 
the cooldown for switching characters is extended to six seconds when a character takes the stage their normal attack speed and movement speed oh that is great for kokomi will be increased by 15 percent hp recovery is 15 percent and elemental energy recovered blah 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 by 100 percent oh oh that sounds fantastic so their interruption to resistance will be greatly that sounds that sounds great But, like, you have to stay in character for six seconds? Oh, that's fine. Okay, the active next one. Perpetual Valor. The active character's charged attack no longer consumes stamina. And it's... Oh! <clears throat> and its damage will... <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little nasally today. And its damage will be increased by 40% of the character's... Res uh, 40% period. Character's resistance up to range will be greatly increased when performing its charge attacks. Okay, so the first one is probably a Yellen Constellation. The second one is a... Or is that a Kuki Constellation? Because HP recovery? Wait, the second one is definitely a Yen, Yen Fei Constellation. Uh, other characters, obviously, too, but this just really strikes me. When on the field, the character's attack damage will be increased by 25% every 3 seconds. This effect can stack up to 3 times. Transients. When opponents take Electro Charge damage... I'm not, uh, I'm sorry, I don't think I can remember any of these with the, the state that I'm in right now. Uh, their hydro resistance is decreased by 40%. Oh, that's great. So that would be like Coco Mutator Team, Mona Tater Team. After a character's elemental skill hits an opponent, <clears throat> yeah, their elemental skill damage will be increased by 50% for six seconds. Yeah, I didn't remember. Oh, I need to choose which I will equip. Okay, we have. I'm sorry. This is I, the first round's gonna take me a while, and then we're gonna hopefully speed it up. Rock slimes. So we probably want something that can break rocks. I'm thinking Zhongli and Fei. Yeah, and then I guess Hydro. Oh, I can use Sinkcha. Oh, I can use Yellen. Oh, <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> ah. It was like, I have Yellen, I have Sing Chung. <laughs> then I realized, wait, the levels aren't... There is something not right about the levels. Mm. Okay. Again, I really didn't sleep a lot last night, so we're going to blame it on that. <clears throat> and Animal for fun, I'd say. Should we give the Traveler some love? Okay, so we'll pick this. I have a bad feeling that if I pick one now, it's going to run out and I'm not going to be able to use it later. Is that true? <laughs> um, and last one is character's attack damage increased or electric. No. Character's elemental skill. No. Let's go with the attack damage. That sounds great. Okay. Quick intermission for chat. Yeah, back to the Archons, the Traveler would have to pay for everything. Sorry, I should keep up more with the chat, but, um, you know what? I'm saying it. It would be worth it. I'm willing to farm an entire week of, oh, this is painful to think about, of just Blossoms of Revelation, uh, of wealth, to make it happen. I I'm going to be their patron. It's fine. <laughs> Yai Sakura, my favorite Yai expert, is coming through with a good advice. I'll keep that in mind for sure. Uh, her third and fifth, the third and the fifth buff would be great for her. So long as she stays on field, is that a requirement really? I mean, that's good in my books. If yeah, I need to stay on field. Okay, focus. When each combat round ends, three challenges are completed. The current party setup must be adjusted. Once oh yeah, once. Only one member of the current party can be selected to continue on. And the rest cannot be deployed again. Okay. We'll see how Our it goes. Mampus wine tastes the same as I remember. But where are those who share the memory? Dad, we just talked about it. We're going to get you all together. We want to make it happen. Help us make it happen. Okay. Hard? 
We can do hard, right? Quick disclaimer, I have like a dongle on that makes it a little more difficult for me to play, but we can do it. Oh wait, oh no, how does this go again? Okay, I run around, I put them all in my stuff. Okay, and then do I do the charge shots now? I think I do, or do I do it now? Okay, whatever, we're doing it now. Oh, they're so good together. No. Wait, that's it? Did I do okay or... <gasps> I chose the wrong Yenfei. That is not my Yenfei. I li Oh my god. I have a triple crown Yenfei and I chose their level 80 Yenfei. And her stats are worse than mine. Why did I do that? Oh, okay. It's fine. Yenfei doesn't need the extra thing. She, right? She's 888. No, she's, yeah, she's 888. I'm so, <laughs> oh, hey, boys. No, you. Oh, it worked. Uh. But these are so easy. Am I missing something? This is nothing. I was exp mm -hmm. I'm a little confused. I will have order. Oh, I need to wait, right? Okay. Run, run, run. Oh, this is so fun. The temptation to pull. The temptation to pull. Oh, this is ready. Oh, I messed up. Okay, never mind. It's fine. This is not sweaty at all. Hey, dude. Oh, they're level 60. Why are they level 60? It's okay. Gangs up on silver. Inadmissible evidence. Incinerate. Yeah, he nukes all stages with that. Yeah. They don't have a time to blink, though, I imagine. They just don't. Oh. Okay, so, I, see, I would select Yenfei, but I'm kind of angry that I selected the wrong Yenfei. This is an imposter Yenfei. So I will be selecting Yelan. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Selects you a lot. Gets hydro items. <laughs> okay, that's... No, that's... That's great. Um... Okay. Ooh, good thing we kept Chi Chi. Are the buffs always the same? No, they're not. There is a Shao buff with jumping abilities increased. But I suppose everybody can become a Shao with that. Assurance, the active character's attack speed will be increased by 30%. Oh, that's the... Okay, those that I chose change. Those I didn't choose change. After the active character's plunging attack hits opponents, their plunging attack damage will be increased by 20%. I kind of want to do Yai plunging attack, only because we would keep seeing her tail, and that would be so cute. At the same time, I didn't bring a shielder, and I'm afraid she's going to die in the process. And, oh, at the same time, we have Electro enemies, so that's definitely not going to happen. Okay. Next time, maybe I. That would be so cute. Um, yeah, I guess we're going with a Cryo team, but I don't know if I have mine built right now. I think I do. Should we just pretend that I do and not inquire if I do? No, I'm going to check. Oh, I can. If I exit now, will my progress be lost? Yeah, I'll, I'll exit now and see. So if the enemies were level 60 now, I assume they're gonna increase the level scaling? 
What is happening? Huh? Didn't I just do that? Oh. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, Sakura just let me know that the trial characters do in fact adapt with the constellations. So that's good, at least. Even though my stats did not. I don't think they did. Did they? Yeah, they definitely did not. Oh, her crit damage was higher. <laughs> Never mind. I take my criticism back. Anyways. Yeah, you know what? I think Yanan C2 or C1 already makes it so that every single one of Yenfei's attacks can be vaporized, um, which we can't do with Singcho. He's a little too slow. Some hits aren't vaporized, so that's pretty cool. Just saying, good case for Yenfei. <clears throat> okay. Oh yeah, he's good. He's chillin'. I think we're, we're going with you. And then Chi-Chi. Chi-Chi! Chi-Chi! You know, the fact that she's not built, that she has really, really not great artifacts and low talents, her heals are good. So we're gonna just progress and see if we die or not, but I don't think so. Okay. Right. Um, we said... Wait. Oh, right. I chose Yellow. Um... Oh, Shenhe's here! I wanted to do Swirl, but maybe I'll use Shenhe because Shenhe is cool. Yeah, we're I'm, I'm, we're using Shenhe, Cryo Supremacy. Probably gonna regret that, considering what enemies come later on that I have no idea about. But it's fine. Oh, can I keep them? No, but I don't want to keep them. Attack speed <clears throat> is increased. Their normal attacks will restore HP to them. Well, I wouldn't have needed a healer then. After the active character's Pokemon attacks. I kind of want to save those for Yai. I really want to see her tail pop up and her doing cute jumps. I want to see that. Electro charge. No, that's not happening. Oh, uh, this is, uh, these all aren't too great, I'm not gonna lie to you. None of this fits my team. This fits my team. This doesn't really, the charged attacks, no. <sighs> you know what, let's just confirm this. Oh, we can't? Huh? We need to pay? Hmm. Oh, I see how this works. Sorry, I'm taking long. Um... Let's just use this, I guess, and can we, we can, oh, I could have redrawn. What, what happens if I redraw? No, no. No, cancel. We'll, 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 we'll just go with this. Confirm. I'm, I'm going to use two buffs. I, yeah. <laughs> Go for Yellen? You know, I really might. 
if that's what you're implying or um, maybe just my brain is reading it the things I want to read into but um I might uh, hello okay thank you god damn they are they're they're discriminating against Yelan when I fly up here they're blocking my entrance My Faye do be furious right now. I don't know. I feel like my Faye could do a lot better. Well, hard, of course. Okay. Gotcha. Isn't that the saying? Remind me, do I do her charge attacks now? Or after this? Oh, this is cool. No, wait, this is actually cool, though. Come on, god dang it. What's the hurry? Oh. Hey, hello. Go. Missed ya. Orders received. A bunch of comments. Cryo incarnate. Freeze. <laughs> this moment will be frozen. Yeah, squirrel would be nice here. <laughs> Whatever. Dodge this. Oh no, don't kill us. It's fine. Don't kill us. Oh my god. Why? I really like Shenha. Oh, well. I'm gonna keep it to myself. <laughs> I feel some opinions are too controversial to share. So this is how we do it, right? And then we do this. And then Kapow. So sorry. Oh. <laughs> what? I keep picking Hydro Girl and they keep giving me Hydro opponents. I feel attacked. They're all level 60. Okay, so we really don't have to get sweaty here. This is, uh. Should we do Electro Charge now? I feel like that's a stupid idea. No, I we should go with Pyro, I think. Let's go Pyro DPSs. Wait, can I change my gear? Please, please, please let me change my gear. We're gonna do who? Who? Lan? Ye Tao? Oof. Let me steal your face feather. Am I saving for anyone right now? Yeah, I'm saving. Well, saving. I have enough Primos. So my next five stars guaranteed and I'm really close to. So I'm kind of saving for Kazuha. Because, yeah, I mean, that's Kazuha. And I really want to get, even though that's a long, long way ahead, I really want to get some Yai Constellations and also her weapon. Gradually, obviously. Um, and other than that, I'm kind of interested in Baiju. So no, not really. But the thing is, it's not just Yelan, right? Like I said earlier with Shenhe, Mihoyo just keeps bringing out amazing characters. And uh, the anxiety of pulling for someone and then realizing that oh and then like the next patch another character coming around that you like even better you know when i pull for a character i want to be for sure for sure sure <laughs> i want to be very sure that i that i will like them that being said kind of yell on theoretically is indispensable for me because i do have the philosophy of only using characters that you really like and i'm personally not the biggest fan of Sing Cho. Like, he's fine. But, um, I don't know. I just, no one feels so strongly about him. I don't particularly like his English voiceover. So, I don't know if she has gear on, but they're 60, so we're going to be fine. So, yeah, like, philosophically speaking, if I were to follow my philosophy, it wouldn't make a lot of sense for me to get Yelan because I do like her better than Sing Cho. Um, but I'm just so anxious 
that a char- another character like Yai basically is gonna come where I just think, holy crap, like, yes. And I don't know if Yelan is that for me yet. Um, after entering combat, non-active party members will regenerate three elemental energy. No, no, we don't want that. <laughs> after a character uses their elemental burst, all char- party members' elemental burst damage will be increased by 50%. Oh, that could be cool. All party members' normal charged attacks gain 50. Oh, oh yeah, we want that. Not done yet. After the active character's normal attack hits an opponent, their normal attack damage will... No. After their active... I think we could go with that because I don't charge too often with who. Like, it's a little difficult and I run out of stamina. <sighs> I guess we could go with that. I guess we could go with that. Cool. They're gonna charge us with many new five star in some room. See, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. And I am, like personality wise, I'm inclined to believe that I'm I'm a dendro type of wait, what is that sentence? Let me rephrase that. I think I like dendro a lot. You know, I like nature very much, so I have a feeling it's gonna be up my alley. So I'm just anxious. I'm just Oh, I need to <laughs> Okay, break out. Ah, uh, we're good, we're good. <gasps> Wait, I thought I switched weapons. They didn't let me switch. Wait, so it's like literally you enter with the gear you had on before. This weapon is nonsense for who? Okay. Like I said, level 60. Nobody cares. But that's strange to me. Is there a button I missed? <laughs> what is... Prototype, what's it called? I'm using the prototype star glitter on my hotel. Which gives her... Oh, actually, that's not as abysmal as I thought. But her attack is very low now. <laughs> that is hilarious. Sacred Sakura petals, right? I lost my 50-50 to Yulan, on Yulan to Jean. And you wanted to keep going for her, but, you know, Kaz was around the corner. Yeah, it's kind of... I get that. Kazwa... Kazwa's... For real, though, are there people who do not like him? Does that exist with Kazwa? I feel like... Kazuha is just all beloved. Mostly because he's, you know, such a good spoiler and he just has a very broken kit. But also, like, undeniably, he's just... He has a great personality and a great design. So, like, there's literally... What is there not to like with him? Okay. I think that was... No! Don't freeze me! I freeze you! I put you in prison. Even though I'm not playing the Entei right now. This is absolutely what I do. Time to go. Ugh, see? 46k burst damage. Ugh. What is this? Busted. Here comes the cash. Okay. You can't run. <laughs> Maybe it would make more sense to use Rosie if she has the good gear. You want Kazuo too, but you're most likely gonna have to use the Joker card. Which is the I'm glad he clarified. Which is the hundred uh, crystal pack, still with a double bonus. Yeah, you know what I hate. <laughs> Philosophically or not, Yellen is an amazing support. Simply put, yeah, man. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Let's check rewards. Let's see if I did enough or do. <laughs> Please. Please let me, that have been enough. Oh, 
already come damn so many new mechanics here they already give you the rewards automatically interesting oh no i'm in the wrong thing is this the one there's so much we have to do still <laughs> oh boy <laughs> wait a minute Okay, I'm back. I I just realized I missed a lot. Okay, so there's... Is the mic still okay? I think it is. Okay, there's here the Apex hostility is what I missed. That's why we only had level 60 enemies. <laughs> okay, that's good. Also, with the rewards... Great news, I got the bow, which was really important to me. Second, because it just looks amazing when I look at it. Um, second, are these rewards I get from doing the challenge we just did, or do I have to do another another dungeon? Dire Cliff Court on Stern Antagonism. Let's see. Yeah, that's the one. Okay, guys, I'm sorry, we're going to have to go back in. Should we do Apex Facility? Let's do it, right? Why not? I'm very confident. And also, now we know the enemies and which, uh, what enemies come in which succession. So that's good. Wait, I, I'm really into character and pulling talk, so I'm going to jump into chat and see what everybody's saying. Yeah, thank you for telling me. So we did that. Everybody's just gushing about Kazuo, which, fair enough, fair enough. Um, 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 um. Kind of want to try the same thing. Before we do it, though, oh my god, I'm giving Butao her gear. Wait, she has it! Okay, now it should register, though, right? Um, also, Koza writes, Traveler's un underrated DPS. I don't know about DPS, but I have been using them more lately because I just felt something's missing without them. <laughs> and I honestly have been really enjoying it, and I've also been pleasantly surprised. And I've used the Traveler a lot too, but um, Anima Travelers, you know, in certain situations are perfectly fine actually. Who was the third slot? Was there a third slot? Ooh, we could go with Yai. She could she could say a brief hello. I feel like we'll need her. I haven't been acknowledging Yai enough in my streams. <laughs> it's been all about Yanfei, which is fair, but like I need to show the girls some love too. Uh, after entering combat, non-active party members will regenerate three elemental particles per second. Yes, okay. Uh, actually, I don't know. After the active character's plunging attack, no, all period, uh, charge attack, 50 elemental damage bonus, sure. Increases all party members' elemental skill and elemental burst level by one, the maximum upgrade. Oh, <gasps> I want that. Okay, oh, bye. This is great. We love that. I'm, okay. Mihoyo lured me into a false sense of security with these level 60 enemies this is gonna be probably a lot a very different experience wait i already have apex hostility Shinko hardy still um i feel like that might be i don't know if i'm ready for that but 
Here goes nothing, I guess. Ah, come, come. Emerge right now. Emerge. Motion to compel. I'm always watching. Come on out right now. Emerge. Is there someone left? Who's left? Oh. Gotcha. Oh, that flows so well. Yes, this is fun. That was great. I like this a lot better than the first stage. That was that was that was really nice. Okay. I put <laughs> I picked the wrong end again. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> oh my god, why am I like this? Charge shot. I love her play style. <laughs> right now. Emerge. Right now. Oh, drop your shield, man. A sight to behold. Right here. Right now. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so much fun. Stop. Oh, probably Dad's ult would have been a lot better. This is order. Say goodbye to that very thick shield. God dang it. Quiet. Emerge. Right now. Right here. I just have one question. Am I in a time limit? Probably am, right? I should probably hurry up. Right now. Right here. Busted. Motion to compel. I'm always watching. Aww. Right now. Right here. Emerge. I will have order. Gather. Quiet. Oh no, her turrets ran out. It's okay, we got this. Yefe got this. Yefe Supremacy. Oh, that was great. I like this team. I like this team a lot. Um, who do I choose? I'm choosing Yalan. I mean, I need a good assessment on whether or not I'll actually, you know, potentially maybe, maybe pull for her. Oh, new opponent, though. Oh, <gasps> yes, let's do a, do we have good buffs? I want to do a Yalan Kokomi thing. Oh, that could be so good. That could be so great. Animal Traveler is your fave Traveler, Sakura Petals. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I do get a little a little annoyed when people hate on uh, Electro Traveler's damage because that's not really what they're meant for. I understand we want a Traveler DPS, but that's not what they were intended to do at all. So I feel like comparisons are a little unfair there. You should be testing their energy recharge capabilities more, in my opinion, and their support cap capabilities. But I still agree with you. I <laughs> don't even really bother with the other two uh greatly enhances the character's jumping ability no crit rate will be increased by 30 percent 30 percent oh my god when an active character deals damage to opponents while having 100 percent elemental energy mm, that is so interesting these are fun buffs the city of switching characters is extended to six seconds oh that one we already know when an active character's charge attack, I want a movement speed one. Give me a movement speed one. Can I redraw? Uh, oh, I need to choose. I want, I want movement speed. Wait. Increases. Attack speed movement. Okay, we have one. We have one. That's good. When the active character's charge attack hits an opponent, they will generate one elemental particle over two... Uh, uh, after the active character's normal attack hits an opponent for three times, they will unleash.
Oh, that could work too. <laughs> Can I redraw one? Let's redraw this one. Let's hope that we get something good. Oh, not really though. I guess we'll just do this. It's fine. I'm excited for this one. Okay. Ah, too bad. No, no, uh, yai, but Shogun will do. There is no time limit pressure. Hey, that's cool. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I sometimes really beat myself up when I can't get a perfect score in these things, and Spiral Abyss especially. Like, at a certain point, I just feel like such a failure. So, I like this. Oh, I didn't think of a rotation. What's my rotation? No idea. Okay. Wait a minute. We need to think of this. <laughs> okay. Lay down the cocoa fish. Oh no, I can't. I forgot I put the buff that didn't let me switch characters so quickly. Oh, that's a problem. Okay. We're gonna have to get used to this. Just have a little patience. Oh no, this is not gonna work. Not with this team. It's not. This is a problem. Oh, this could be such a fun team if they will let me switch characters. <laughs> Maybe I just need a different setup. Maybe this is fine. Oh my god, I just messed up. Horribly. <laughs> Let's just do this. Wait, I want to think about this because this team, in theory, is so much fun. My idea is yell on E. No. Write in E. Yell on E. Kokomi E. Yell on. No. Sucrose E and Q. Yell on Q. Kokomi Q. Repeat. Do you get my drift? That could be so fun, but I don't think because we would at least have to. We could. Can we redo this? Confirm. I want to redraw the charms. This is not working. Reset this round. Yes! Axel, stay! Wait, I'll lend you a charger somehow. <laughs> you don't have a charger? <laughs> No, don't worry about it. Um, go, go, go take care of your phone and come back. We definitely want you around, that's for sure. But do as you have to and please, for sure. <laughs> no stress. Um, okay, we need a different buff. Redraw. Let's go with the... Uh, I still need the movement speed one. Let's, let's read each other one we got. Ugh, these are all bad for this team. I guess we'll just use this. But if we use it, it's going to be used up, right? Okay. We'll just, you know what? We don't need two. We don't need three buffs. This is fine. This team can do it. I'm sure of it. Watch it. Let's get down to business. Work guy number three. Busted. Absorption test. Stand clear. Whoa, mark two. Wait. Gotcha. <laughs> now this with movement speed would be amazing but i'm gonna take it yeah. um because the other buffs within that one are really really cool i forgot what they are i just remember them being cool um, someone asked why everybody chooses the one where you can't switch between characters. 
Come into the squid, uh, to the jellyfish. Come here, come here, people. Come here. Kind of want to queue with Raiden. Let's do it. Wait, was her eye up? I don't think it was. Oh boy. Don't want to waste your. Oh, hello. <laughs> he just flew in space, I guess. Okay. But then the enemies take an ungodly amount of time to die. Okay. Two only? That's it? Okay, fine. Let's do this. Hello? Uh, Shogun? Hmm. Oh, hello. <laughs> Busted. Sign down. Here comes the cash. Animal hypostasis and you like covenant of the deep. I'll help it at all. Oh my god, stop smacking my cocoa around. Oh, he's dead? He's dead. Oh no, he's on my toe. Don't. Mm. Illusion. Absorption test. Animal test. 6308. Chaos ensues. <laughs> Busted. Busted as hell. <sighs> uh, this hurts to say goodbye to them, but it must be done. Okay. Oh no! Wait, no! I need Coco Me. <laughs> no, not Mungo Kinky, no. Um, one second. I'll just do another shout out. Okay, I also feel like we need to pick up the pace. <laughs> Um, so, okay, let's see about this. I, does Mungo Kinky have cryo resistance? I always wonder about that. I feel like he has cryo and animal resistance. I have no idea what team I want to use. So, looking at the buffs, actually, looking at the buffs might make sense if I don't know what team to use. The active character's attack speed, there you are, that is what you wanted, will be increased by 30%. When hitting the opponent, the normal attack will restore HP to them, the amount of which is equal to 5% of their max. HP. Okay, we already know that one. Uh, after the active character's charge attacks, um, when the oh, we could do who yeah, you who yell on in the stat. Mm hmm. I'll play my lord and charge attack. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Okay. Yes, yes. I, this is fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is good. Okay. Um, the only thing that I'm not feeling great about is us not, ha not having Zhongli <laughs> or Kokomi. Because I don't know if my Chi-Chi can do it, to be honest with you. Um, and no sucrose. Oh. Oh. Should we use a traveler? Or Kaya. But will Cryo or. 
you know what we just talked so much about the traveler let's pay them an homage i don't know how flattering that homage will be but we're doing it um charge attack charge attack oh we could i guess we could use that Hmm. Superlative or immaculate? Which what should we do? Increase in elemental bursting skill or increase in attack because we have a, a pull arm user, a sword, and a bow user. Hmm. I mean Yellen doesn't benefit from attack whatsoever. I think Hu Tao only to a certain extent. Chi Chi does a lot. Her heals would be a lot better. Um I think I'm gonna go with the burst one though. Uh, with the level one. You would advise not using cryo or animo against them. <laughs> well, rest in peace to party members of mine. We could try Kaching. I don't ever use Kaching instead of Lumine. Right? Maybe that could be fun. Let's let's save Lumine for the last stage. Though I feel Sorrel would be really, really good here. Like with the small treasure hoarders. No, let's go, let's go with Kaching. Let's try this. Okay. Keep on going. Uh, <laughs> if I can find the door. <laughs> oh my god, this is this is gonna be a meme. <laughs> Me struggling <laughs> to find the right way around the battle, uh, around everything. Oh, hello, see Sucrose. Uh -huh. Um Oh thanks, my hotel's back, thank god. Oh, don't hurt her. I mean actually do. She needs to lose some HP. My hoop is looking too healthy right now. Bust it. Nowhere to hide. Chick, 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 chick. I love that. <laughs> so cool. This is cool. This is okay. I love that it's not yeah. like theory crafting or anything. This is just a couple of DPS characters going to town. And yes, I'm calling Yella in the DPS character. I think I absolutely believe she has it in her. I know she does, actually. Yellen's busted. I will be continuing to compliment her, Puzzler. I'm sorry. <laughs> what can I say? Y'all have such interesting conversations. I can't help but eavesdropping sometimes. You know how it is. Why does Electro run out so quickly? Wait, where are you? Ah, don't do that. <gasps> Wait, no! Wait, can I restart? <laughs> Should we? I don't want to reset. Okay, we're resetting. I'm sorry, we're not gonna reset again. I don't have time to reset. But how did she die so quickly? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're not resetting after this. I don't care who dies, or if who dies. <laughs> Busted. We really gotta get going with the quest. Cut to the chase. Chick, 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 chick. <laughs> Did you see how I dodged that? That was funny. Nowhere to hide. Incoming. Hello?
Ooh. Just such style. Mango, look, if I died here, what's gonna happen with Mango Kinky? Oh my lord, it's gonna be rough. Okay. I have the bursts a lot better time right now. Yeah. No, I would like you. Oh my god. No, no, no! Uh, you know what? Uh, my food's not looking too good. Okay, actually, run. <laughs> oh boy, not good. Not good, not good, not good, not good. Uh, thank God for Yelan and her amazing speed. Whew. That was close. Mango Kinky next, I'm sure. Hey, Alkio! So glad you could make it! Nice seeing you, man. Really cool. We're just trying out this limited event thing. I forgot what it's called. And we might die now. This might be it. <laughs> Let's heal up a little. Actually, Kuching could need some heals. Smack, smack, smack. Damn, Chi Chi's an OP healer. Okay. Okay, I'm planning on using Kuching's burst when he does his whole this. Okay, that worked out great. Now I don't know what to do. Go into the corner. <laughs> keep clicking the uh, run button when I want to do her speed run, but I have to remember to elemental skill. <laughs> it's not the normal. Uh oh. Orders given. Orders received. Go. Yeah, we're being messy now. Quiet now. Don't blink. Head to the chase. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Oh. Okay, that didn't do anything. That's cool. Oh. I wasn't worried. That was easy. Yeah, thank you. Alkyo, your, your words made it happen. You believed in me and I thought that. And that's how we made it happen. What can I say? Thank you for letting me succeed. Ah, oh, gifts. Is that what we need to refine the bow with? Uh, no idea, actually. Okay, this was fun, but um, I want to get back into the lore because six hours remaining. And I think we have to, in fact, to continue with the other ones. So let's just go. This is the wrong thing. Let's just, let's just go here. <laughs> Hey, best girl. Oh, I need to wait until the next day. Technically, I could do my commissions now. In the meantime, while we're waiting. But only technically. Congrats, thanks. <laughs> this is fun. We already talked a lot about it, but this is it's a fun event. Do you agree? I'm speedrun- Bro, yeah. I am speedrunning the event. Like, I- <laughs> everything we're doing everything in one sitting with a clock very much ticking loudly and ominously in the background oh 
You mean fly? Uh, all right, fly free then. Basically, Paimon just wants out of here. Yeah, it's super fun being up. Yeah, I mean, I'm having fun here, Paimon. I don't know what you're going on about. Just a day? No, it feels like we've been down here for months. Uh, maybe not months, but at least like 20 days, surely. I actually have to agree with her. I could swear we're streaming for already four hours. Yo, yo. Only been two? Chucker. Mm. Well, everyone, I just completed another survey of the surrounding area. Still nothing has changed today. Here, have some water and take a rest. Cookie's such a mommy, though. Uh, I mean, like, no, I didn't mean it like that. Wait. <laughs> I mean, like, she's such... Thanks she's the mom of the group. <sighs> it's easy to forget to keep hydrated down here. Right? This is literally the mom of the group. Every friendship group has a mom. And yes, I am usually that person. <laughs> Out. I want out. All I want is to cruise the streets and have beetle fights again. That's your top Boss, priority, my guy. Your image to consider. But it's so boring walking around this hole every day. I, if only I could slurp some ramen and see the beautiful flowers again. Okay, that I can get behind. Ramen? I agree. Wait a minute. Speaking of ramen, traveler, are you hungry? Mm -mm. I'm not hungry either, but let me pose the question this way. Who is the biggest eater among us? Paimon. It's definitely not me. Hey, what's everybody looking at me for? <laughs> well, it's definitely not me. If anyone, it's this one right here. I agree. Uh, what are you looking at Paimon for? Paimon, are you hungry? Um, no. Paimon's not hungry. Why do you ask? Dot dot dot. Uh, that's the case. Huh? What 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 am I missing here? Paimon says she feels like it's been at least twenty days. Yes, I heard that too as I was walking over. The question is, how can you not feel hungry even after twenty days? And I feel like it's only been about one day. Oh right, they don't have even like the sun and the moon to guide them. That's also strange. Of course, everyone has different perceptions of the passage of time. But how could one person feel like it's only been one day and someone else 20 days? Yeah, now that you mention it, I feel like we've been here three, four, five days, but I don't feel hungry or thirsty at all. Although I cooked some food, it wasn't because I was hungry. I just wanted to keep our spirits up. I was planning on saving our rations so we could survive a few more days, but I haven't really felt hungry since. Yeah, nobody now touched that, I that food. About it, not only am I not hungry, but I don't feel any real signs of fatigue either. Whether I sleep or not doesn't seem to have any effect on how I feel. Yes, I concur. Resting doesn't make me feel more refreshed, and staying awake doesn't make me any more tired. Very <coughs> peculiar. It's almost as if our physical state has been suspended. Hmm. Uh, the more you say, the scarier it sounds. Paimon doesn't even want to think about it. I wonder if Xiao's experience is the same phenomenon. Hmm? What's wrong, Aww, no mean of thinking of that Xiao. <laughs> it's pretty weird. Sounds like the little dude must be in danger. But he is an adeptus. This kind of situation should be no trouble for him. I fear that this problem underground is bigger than we thought. I found something, everyone. I just discovered a new path over there that seems to lead to an unknown area. You mean a way out? Oh, finally! Let's go have a look at that. You found something! Oh, please, please see the exit! I still suspect things can't be that simple. We should all stay prepared for whatever comes. Huh? Paimon doesn't see anything out of the ordinary here. I'm still really floored by Cookie's voice. I expected something entirely different, but I really like what they did. That appearances can be deceiving. As I was examining the wall just now, I noticed there was something unusual about this stone. Hmm. Seems to me that it's been created using some illusory magic. Hidden behind it lies a passageway. Whoa! So there really is a path behind here! Gotta 
of hand it to you, that sure wasn't easy to find. But at least we can finally get out of here. Yeah, thanks to Yelan. Miss Yelan's determination Yelan. and eye for detail are certainly impressive. Not to mention, you've hardly had any rest the whole time we've been trapped here. It doesn't matter. I'm not tired. <laughs> well, given we're already here, we might as well go in and explore. Right behind ya! Paimon can't wait to get out of this place! Continue exploring. No, pause out. I am channeling this atmosphere, so I am not hungry. I feel not hungry and as though time is passing in a strange manner. Oh, another ruin. Hurrah. No Geo in current party. Hmm. Yeah, well, that can be fixed. Where is she? Where is she? Oh. <laughs> Let's get this show on the It's weird. Since yesterday there have been like two characters have been missing. One of them has been Yunjin and the other one is Chi Chi. I don't know why. Just happened. And now I just want to use them. Uh the symbols of the platform will have different colors and images. Matching them together seems to be the key to solving the puzzle. If you step on the Oh no, a puzzle. If you step on the card symbol, it will activate. But you will take damage if you step on the wrong are you mm, okay. Well, if you step on the wrong one, it'll take damage. Search for and activate all the symbols on the platform to solve the puzzle. I take my answer back. I feel like I could use some brain food now. Okay. Uh-huh. Wait. We know these from Enconomia, don't we? Wait, what? What? Lucy, is that you? Hey, did anyone else just hear that voice? It sounded super creepy. Um. Okay, what are these symbols? The okay. And where are the clues that let me know which one I need to step on? Should we just try running over them and see what happens? Oh, okay. This can't be a trial and error, error thing though, right? Or can it? There, there has to be a clue somewhere. I can't just be guessing about these things. That does not make sense to me. Which one lit up here? That one. Okay, let's just try lighting up all of them. <laughs> that does not seem wrong, at least. So that's great. Oh. Oh, that was pretty easy. Let me scribe. Just... Trial and error, I guess. Flags up. Huh. Your grand finale sphinx is upon you. Yeah. Boom, boom. Huh. You know, I used to think Yunjin and Yenfei don't go well together because Yenfei relies on charged attacks. But then I realized I could just make every attack of Yenfei a charge attack by using Yunjin's buff. Oh, shield. Give me a shield. On the main platform, I see which one I need. Big brain sta uh, strats. Y'all are smart, and y'all can read. I read things, but I don't absor uh, absorb them, apparently. Okay. The light shapers on the platform will shine unique beams of light upon the platform. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Wait, no. <laughs> I should read. Light upon the platforms opposite to them. Operate these devices to control the position and direction of the beams. Light. That sounds complicated. The light shapers may be used to, uh, to cast light upon the large symbols on the platforms. <sighs> Opposite to them, thereby activating those symbols. Activating all the large symbols seems to be the key to solving the puzzle. Okay. 
I don't know if I understood that, but chat's here to help. <laughs> Big brained, very smart, chat is here to help. Um... Oh, wait, I can't pull them apart? See, I feel like this would be down here. This beam would go to the one on the right left. And the one on the in the top left corner would go into to the one that I'm beaming at right now. Or no, actually it would go to the one on the left. What does this do? Oh, I can I can angle them. That is interesting. Why are there two beams? Oh. <laughs> oh, I think I see. Okay. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Do I need to touch these again or does this ruin? No, it doesn't. <laughs> I need to touch them. Okay, there's nothing here. I love the music. No. Listen. Wait. Hit me. Don't bite you. Is some sort of battle taking place here? I wonder who could be involved. Oh, that's the wrong one. Oh, that's the wrong one. Okay, <laughs> that is the right one. <laughs> I mean, you could check on the main platform or you could just abuse the MC. Right, guys? Oh, just a sec. No! Spare me. Your cheat codes. Uh. Let me scry. Oh, these are gonna be tough Let's to break. Fly. Oh my god, this is gonna be tough. By Your grand finale. Boom, boom. Oh wait, let's use let's let's use Mona. What did we bring her for? Yeah, that's right. Look at the totem. Look at the totem. So interesting, isn't it? Let me scroll. Wow. So fascinating. I feel like a squirrel could do something. No. <laughs> oh. No. I hope the puzzle part isn't too boring for y'all. Oh, let's not forget about this. Oh, they all are different. That makes so much sense. So I will have to go back to the last one. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, but it makes sense. I like it when things make sense a lot. <laughs> Sometimes it takes me a while to see that they actually make sense, but eventually I'll get there. Perfect. Now, how do I... Right, that's how I do it. I go to the other... To the other one. Oh my god. I'm a genius. But this... Um... Huh? Did I mess up? I think I messed up. Oh, 
Okay. <laughs> Puzzle is the best part. Well, I'm glad you feel that way. And y'all get to feel good about yourselves if you get it quicker than I do, so. Ah, uh, this one we half did, and then I left no. because... If it's still alive, why would you become like this? Never mind, it's a new one. Attack you. <gasps> oh no! Whoa, sounds like someone forgot to invite us to the fight. Let's go and help him. Oh guys, I know what just happened. Oh, that is so sad. No! That's the spirit of Xiao, and this is... Is this Xiao's mask? It's like... And a memory that happened a long time ago, and it's about his Yaksha friend, right? Right- oh my god, what am I doing? Where's the horn... thing? Oh, that is so sad. But I can't wait to learn more about the Yakshas, I'm gonna be really honest. Oh, that's the same symbol. Oh god. Okay, that doesn't work. It was worth a try. Okay. Oh. Shield. <laughs> Give me shield. Shadows of fate, written in the stars. Guys, poor Shao. Okay, let's do this. I like this part. This is fun. Um she said Yeah. Yeah, I think I got this. Okay. So cool. Can we look up? Wow. Oh, come on. This game is great sometimes. Oh my god. It's so funny because Alkyo said earlier we're speedrunning and I agreed, but I don't feel like I'm speedrunning. Like, we're taking our time enjoying all the scenery and the music and the dialogue and. You know, I'd rather not finish everything than rush, I think. Oh, and this is where you need the symbols. Okay, so the green one, this is what we're looking for. It all makes sense now. Let's see. Let's complete the green one. Um, I think I already forgot the symbol. Oh wait, we already lit it up. We just didn't take care of these things. Okay. Oh no, this is correct. This is the one- right, this is the one I already half did. Cool, purple. One left. I like Xiao. I mean, I don't love him so much that I pull for him, but he's he's good. I know a lot of people feel very intensely about him. Like Xiao stands, they will show up, show up for him.
Oh, we did the beam thing here. Oh, so we're missing the symbol thing? Oh, <laughs> that is funny. I did not check the symbol. Uh, okay. I think the only one we did have is either the one on the left or the one in front of us. Ah. <laughs> yes. Wait. Oh. I love that each dungeon- oh no 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 no, I'm so quick. <laughs> each dungeon appears to be tailored for one of the- oh god. For- for one of the- one of the characters in the story. One of which is Yenfei and I just killed her. Ah, so aggressive. Yeah, right? <laughs> I might sit here for six hours, but we're gonna get to the end. In style, while enjoying everything. Uh, get, I'm glad you get me. Okay, where's the center? Let's go back to the center. Should be it, right? We did the beams. We did the beams. Look at that. I mean, not, not at her. I mean, <laughs> okay. Guys, look at the sky. Where's Noelle? I'm not using Noelle, sorry. Mm -mm. She's great, I love her personality, but she's slow and I can't. But yeah, Noelle could have easily shielded, DPS, and healed herself from whatever damage she might have taken in that fight, absolutely. What now? What now? I'm pretty sure I'm done. <gasps> Did I do not? Wait. No. This isn't glowing. But we just were there. <laughs> Why is it not? What, what am I missing here? Oh. That's strange. Did I just, did I miss it? Did I not? I don't know. <sighs> okay, here we go. It looks so pretty. <gasps> Are these the colors of the Yakshas? It's only four, so one's missing. Green was Shao. The red one's missing. The light seems to be leading to another platform. Let's go and take a look. Okay, but which portal do I take? Yeah, we have green, purple, yellow, and blue. And I think there's a red one. What's the objective? Oh, it doesn't tell me. Oh no, this is my brick. <laughs> it is my greatest enemy's back <laughs> orientation. Oh, that seemed like a door. Is that a door? <laughs> my greatest enemy. Oh boy. I feel like this is the one. 
I don't see the light going there at all, but it's the one, all right. Grand has dissolved? What's down there? Is that little dude called Xiao down there? <laughs> little <gotta> dude. <laughs> Hold on. Something's not right here. What's this? It appears to be a small fissure. What can you possibly find inside? It can't be a living person, can it? Watch out, Edo. Conqueror of demons? Xiao, is that you? Uh-oh. Uh -uh. Quit trying to scare us, okay? Huh? Wait, is this some kind of illusion? Paimon can't touch him! Conqueror of demons, can you hear us? I love that he addresses him like that. What happened? Are you okay? It just fits her. Hello, That's what I'm saying. little dude. He isn't responding. What's going on here? You. Uh oh. Oh, he finally said something. I don't like his tone. Oh. We followed your voice and found you here, but it's kind of strange. We can't touch you. How did you become an illusion? <sighs> an illusion. Talk about a coincidence. We were just thinking you went missing and stuff, and. And then we heard the sound of you fighting. Pretty lucky we found you, if you ask me. <laughs> you didn't get hurt, did you? When Ito's not being annoying, he's just so damn likable. Like, Max Middleman's voice just... He's... <laughs> when he's not being annoying, absolute buddy vibes. Wait. Something's not right. Uh-oh. <laughs> Something's wrong with this domain. Leave now! Get out of there! Oh no! Wait, Xiao! Are you we hurt? Can. We should have him regroup with us as soon as possible. Tell us what happened and where you are now. We'll come find you immediately. No, your safety is the top priority. Good night, Okio. Space can sleep. Sweet dreams. Huh? He disappeared. Great, go. Sounded like he might be injured. We need to go help him. Shall go save yourselves, the group. Let's save him. Seems the only option we <laughs> but have I agree, to group. explore any further is through that entrance over there. <laughs> He's injured and telling us to be careful? It's not like we're in any danger here. Oh my god. Anyway, the secret behind whatever's going on should be in this cave, right? Don't worry, little dude. Ito's on the way. Boss, please don't go charging ahead. You're an oni, not some hunting dog. Don't worry, I'm invincible. <laughs> oh, my butt. <sighs> Looks pretty deep. Be careful, everyone. Huh. Well. Okay. <laughs> Water. <laughs> kind of wish I brought Jung Lee here. Suddenly I miss Jung Lee. That's what I'm saying. I just flip flop around here. Not flip flop, but suddenly I just want a character in my party and then they're not there. Okay, Ito, what do you think? Tough. Axel called it earlier. He literally called it. Didn't he call him butt chucker? Well, there you go. If you hadn't done the quest, I would have said that was divination. Go ahead. You can cry if it Very hurts. Very impressive. I promise I'll try not to laugh. What, what do you mean try not to laugh? You should be feeling some serious sympathy for me right now. But wouldn't feeling sorry for you be a violation of your dignity? Besides, it's harder not to laugh when I'm not the one in pain. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is the <this> scene? <laughs> Paimon, don't laugh. Ah, okay, yeah. Everybody, if you want to laugh at him, just let it out. Exactly, Cookie. You and I. Don't you have a have heart, the same Shinobu? Idea. Oh, people think I'm the monster. Wait a second. I forgot she was here. Xiao's not here, but... Huh? Is that a door? Seems a little out of place here, don't you think? Oh, the door. Someone's laughing at the door. Why is, is the door funny? Maybe or is the scene funny? Of, I don't know, an emergency shelter? There was a picture book I read once that said nice people sometimes build cabins in dangerous places so that anyone in trouble can take shelter inside. That does sound nice. One moment, uh, though, Sakura. 
<laughs> that he he is sounding ominous to me. I don't know if I'm misinterpreting now, stuff there, but uh, door he he. What is that supposed to mean? I wouldn't be too sure about that. Any person with a normal sense of danger wouldn't be so optimistic. Mm -hmm. Wow, bold checker. Looks Butt like checker. your subordinate is telling you what it's butt checker what. now. Oh, I believe she was talking to both of us. Yeah, so you can wipe that smug smile <laughs> off your face. All right, watch and learn, Shinobu. This is why I'm the boss and you're the deputy. If no one is macho enough to open the door, then allow Oh, there he goes. I think that's why you're laughing. By the way, Paimon's and Ito's banter has gotten a lot less aggressive and Step aside. more fun to listen to, in my opinion. Like, it's cute now. In the beginning, they were really at each other's throats, though. Whoa. This door's open. We are out of here. Let's go. Let's go, Ito. You can do it. I believe in you. Come on. Oh. Oh. He tried. A for effort? <laughs> they all look. <laughs> that look. Oh. <gasps> Yo. Evaloni, be gone. Oh, no. You hurt me. Get out of here. No. Don't be racist. Uh, am I seeing things? Or was there someone behind the door? Nah, can't be. <laughs> You're just saying things. Why don't we just open the door again and see? Who? Uh, me? Oh, uh, all right. Uh, I'll open it again. All you do is goof around all day. You're a bad influence to our child. Be gone. Is that like a place that makes your worst fears come to life? In your head, that is. Those people are carrying bowls. Bowls full of beans. <laughs> What's that all about? People throw beans to drive out Oni. Boss is an Oni, so they throw beans at him to get rid of him. He'd be the fright of my life. What are people from Inazuma doing in a place like this anyway? Calm down now. You're a person from Inazuma too, you know. Hey, let's get one thing straight, all right? I'm not a person. I'm an Oni. That's right. Oni pride. Right, but that's I support not the it. Point. The question is, does this door lead to Inazuma? Huh? I no, I don't think so. Possible. Ugh, this place is so weird. I'm starting to think it really is haunted. Open the door again and see if anything changes. You guys go right ahead. I'm not opening it again. So, who's up? Oh, how about Paimon? I want Yenfei to open it. I want to see what scares her. No way! Somebody else do it. Paimon's scared! All right. Or Kuki. That was going to be interesting. That's our Shinobu. Now, don't let whoever's behind that door She's so cool. Around, okay? All right. Let's see what's behind the door this time. Still reading, Shinobu. Listen, young lady. You should keep your nose out of those books and start taking my advice. I've already found you a perfectly good job as a shrine maiden at the Grand Narukami Shrine. You'll be far better off there than... <laughs> Wait, everybody can see it though too, right? From their reactions is what I'm understanding? That is pretty uh, intense. Shinobu? Who is that? No way! Was that who I think it was? Your mama. Oh, this is embarrassing. That voice was my mother. If there's one place I wasn't counting on having to hear that speech again. Your mother wanted you to become a shrine maiden? The whole reason I came to study in Liyue was because I didn't want to become a shrine maiden. My family never approved of my studies. So they wanted me to work in the Grand Narukami Shrine after I returned to Inazuma. Wait, a family that doesn't want their daughter to become a lawyer? Who? Where? Huh? From what we know about Lady Guji, it seems being a shrine maiden is a pretty cushy job. Hey, Paimon keeps jabbing at my Miko. Think of it this way. Some cats can be domesticated and kept in the house, while other cats are meant to survive in the wild. Cats. As for me, I need complete As freedom for me. and space. I'm not a cat. <laughs> well, that being a shrine maiden is a decent job, it's just not for me. We get That's it. That's right. Your calling is with the game. Aww. I mean, just 
Just look at you. You rock. You're totally hardcore. Come on, am I the only one with chills right now? Did we just sleep in a co uh, slip into a cookie Shinobo Shinobu ad? <laughs> it's true. You've got a good thing going. What's Aww. most important is that you enjoy what you do. Look at two best girls. <laughs> Gotta agree with you there. Why is Yellen so like distanced toward Yenfei? Is that just the way she is? Because she's always like, I feel like it's very. She could have said, I gotta agree with you, but she's like, I gotta agree with you there. Am I overthinking? The look of Probably. It, behind the door can change. And not only that, it always changes to something that nobody wants to see. So, uh, how are we gonna get through that? I want to see what nobody wants to see for everyone. Don't forget, we have that little dude waiting for us to save him. Oh, we right. We don't have time. Here. Would any of you like to give it a try? If you all enter at once, maybe it will be too confused. Do it like Bogger Scott style. Mm. No thanks. I'd prefer not to open it if only something terrible awaits. If anyone's going to find a way through, it's not going to be me. Ooh. Uh, why? Because she's secretive. Because I don't buy it. That's why. I don't believe for one second that we're going to find the conqueror of demons by going through that door. So I'm sure as heck not going to be the one to get us through. Wow, she has pretty eyes. Not going to lie. Uh, you don't really sound like you have much of an imagination. <laughs> All right. I'll try. Yeah, my savior. Show Some what you're secrets made of. are fears. Often, what we fear, we're ashamed of, so we keep it secrets. That's why, for Yelan, it might be the same thing in that specific case. I understand what you're saying, Jose. You definitely have a point. Do you have any phobias, Yenfei? Oh wait, this is my time. I should know this. She doesn't like the rain because her codices get wet. Damn, I should know more. <laughs> and what she likes. I know she likes fishing. She likes tofu. She likes reading. She likes talking. She likes the law. What is her fear? Hmm. Yeah, I honestly don't know except for rain. I mean, I could imagine things like not failing in her profession and not helping people as much as she wanted to or breaking the contract she has with her dad. I'm gonna... I'm sure one. I probably do, but nothing springs to mind right now. Well, then try it. Anyway, I suppose I'll find out once I open the door. Ah, oh, I'm so excited to learn. I sound happy. You old geezer. Out of eight pounds of salt, today you gave away three for free, sold two, and exchanged three for booze. How much money did you actually oh, no. make in the end? Civic cases, right? She hates them. Huh? But didn't you tell me to sell things as I please? Why can't I give the customers something for free? Oh, right. That's one of her voice lines. Oh, man, that's so boring. You, you already fool. knew that. You told the old man next door to come and fetch the salt. Well, he broke his leg on the way over, and now his son is asking for compensation. Seriously. No, that's so impersonal. <laughs> Those fears are bullshit. I'm sorry. Huh. A civil dispute. <laughs> or Yenfei is really brave, you know, maybe it's that. Maybe Yenfei is just super brave. I think it's that. The other two are personal. She just doesn't have any fears apart from civic disputes. And girl, I get it. Who are they? They messy. <sighs> no one in particular, but it is a prime <laughs> example of the many difficult civil cases that I've had trouble handling before. Oh. Mm. So you mean you don't like handling disputes over petty matters? Not exactly. What I mean is that I don't like working with people who cannot let go of trivial grievances, Aww. especially of the kind you saw just now. They start with good intentions, but end up making a big fuss. I feel like this is a good picture, too. It's not long before those good intentions plunge into injury and accidents. <sighs> it's always a shame. It's my desire to solve problems for people. That's why I became a legal advisor. It just seems that I still can't fully comprehend the complicated minds of some people. <sighs> I understand what you mean. The human mind is probably both the most complicated and tragic of things. Damn, I agree, Cookie. Also, I love their relationship. I love how they're like both legal geeks and they support each other and they're just, there's so much, I'm getting so many friendship vibes. I suppose there is no need to discuss this any further. Does anyone else want to try the door? Yeah, Lan, go. 
Or traveler. Don't look at me. Why I not? I told you. I'm not taking a chance with that thing. Come on, Yelon. We're a team here. If you're not going to try, then at least give us a convincing reason why. The thing what I don't get is, like, they're not interacting with it. Shouldn't they solve the civic dispute, talk to the mom, eat the beans? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Do something and see if the thing maybe changes, the room changes. In that case, let me be perfectly clear. I serve Ningguang, the Tianxuan Ooh. of the Qixin. The scope of my work includes some of Li Rei's biggest secrets. The chances are, if I open this door, there can be no witnesses left alive. Is that a sufficient reason for you? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sounds sounds impressive. Um, hey, Shinobu, uh, who is Ningguang? She's someone who won't let you walk out of the chasm alive if she finds out that you're prying into her secrets. Boss, you really do need to work on learning who's who in the world these days. Look, I knows what I needs to know. Oh. It's called being a free Oni. Oh, now Paimon gets it. Galen works for Ningguang. <laughs> yes, which is precisely why I was trying to keep her secret. <laughs> we should avoid letting Galen open this door. What about you, Traveler? Would you like to try? Do it, Lumi. Yeah, go for it, Traveler. No, it's hey, not a cheap reason, Puzzle. I'm sorry, completely disagree. Door. It makes a lot Maybe of sense. It could even be I say give it a shot. Who knows? Maybe little dude is waiting for us on the other side. Yanlan's got a point, in my opinion. And Yanfei's opinion, which is more important in this case, for sure. <laughs> I'm just kidding, by the way. Um, find who we're looking for, dot, dot, dot. Damn, Traveler looks for a lot of people. Hmm. Maybe I'm always looking for someone, dot, dot, dot. Sorry, Lumine. Oh. So... Wait, what's Paimon looking at? Oh, is this the abyss? Oh, is, is this what I feared? Huh? The exit suddenly disappeared. Is it trying to trap me here? Girl, I'm ready ready <gasps> music no <sighs> okay investigate <gasps> oh a traveler only domain no this is a hotel story quest all over again That would be cool if they would force us into the traveler ones. I'd like that. Hey, there you are! Whew. You sure had Paimon scared! We couldn't open the door after you went in! Everyone was super Aww, worried about Paimon's you! Paimon's worried for us. Are you okay? Did you find anything, traveler? So, did you find the person we want to rescue inside? No. Judging by the look on your face, I'm guessing you saw something a little unpleasant in there? Yeah, I did. Behind the door I saw... The darkness of the abyss that took my twin away. Huh? How could that be? Ah, uh, don't worry. <gasps> I'm oh. keep searching for him with you. Cheer up! Uh, stupid door, I'll smash you to pieces! If Paima wasn't feeling so exhausted, she'd help out too. Ah. Damn, the traveler's fear was actually quite enough profound. Hey, what is this? Nap time? <sighs> so let me get this straight. Not only did we not find Xiao through that door, we saw all the things that we wish to avoid. I'm starting to have a very ominous feeling about this domain. Mm. It's constantly changing, and its changes seem to be targeted at us. What? What do you mean? I feel the same way. We need to watch our every step. There is definitely more to this. I concur. We came here following the Conqueror of Demons, but we ended up only finding a strange door. 
the things we've encountered on the other side of that door are equally strange. It shows us whatever we fear the most. We're in a space that defies common logic. <sighs> on top of that, I'm starting to feel tired after that experience. But I thought we'd established that getting tired doesn't happen down here. The phenomenon hasn't reached a lethal stage just yet. Otherwise, we would have starved to death without eating for so long. I'm starting to worry that we're being affected by the changes in this space. In order to avoid the sudden accumulation of hunger and fatigue, we should eat and rest regularly from now on. If I, like, didn't know that we'd obviously get out of here safely and I would to really, like, put myself in this situation, this would be so scary. Oh my god, imagine. Anyways, sure, Cookie, you're making a lot of sense, as always. <sighs> I'm suddenly feels exhausted. It's really tiring going through all this. Now that you mention it, I'm starting to feel tired, too. <sighs> no, 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 it's all just an illusion. I will not let my mind play tricks on me. Exactly, you know. Hyman's <sighs> whole body just feels so heavy now. Hmm. According to the current evidence, it seems our physical condition was suspended in this space before which granted us immunity to the effects of fatigue and hunger. According to the current evidence, it seems our physical condition was suspended. And now it seems that mental fatigue is unavoidable. Mm. Though we have yet to locate the Conqueror of Demons, I suggest we go back and get some rest. It'll be difficult to rescue anyone if we're on the verge of collapse ourselves. She's right. Hey, Lavender Melon, you okay? Aww. you? After a persistent search, you find a shortcut that takes you up the entrance. Then you return to the camp and rest. Cool. Okay, I assume this is where if you had started the quest earlier than I did, we would have to wait a couple of days for the next stage to unlock. In the meantime, we can do the next domain. Is what I'm assuming. But first, let's talk to everyone. I'm loving this quest. And we need it for more characters, like similar... Obviously different story lines, but somewhat similar situations. You haven't slept at all. Are you sure you're okay? This place seems even more perilous than we first thought. Don't worry about me. Staying focused under pressure for as long as it takes is my specialty. Now, if I'm not mistaken, looks like you've got some new ideas. <clears throat> Don't mind me. Just uh, taking pictures. <laughs> How could you tell? Aw, that was a cute laugh. It's my job to keep tabs on people. I figured as much. They're just preliminary ideas at this point, but I haven't completely thought them through yet. I'll tell you more once my ideas have taken shape. <laughs> I feel like Yen Fei sure. definitely Sounds has a crush good. on Lei Yelan. What was that laugh? I also have some laugh? ideas of my own. I'll fill you in after I've confirmed some things. Seems like a productive conversation. <laughs> you think so? It's as they say, two heads are always better than one. See. <laughs> Aw, my cuties. <sighs> Cookie. It's hard to believe what we've encountered. About the door. Well, I suppose there's no use hiding it anymore now that everyone's seen it. What you all saw really was my biggest fear. I never want to become a shrine maiden. Who could tolerate such a boring life? After these last few years with the Arataki gang, I suppose you could say I've seen it all. It's taken every skill in my arsenal to constantly clean up the messes they make. Yeah, ultimate rebellious stage, eh? Though the list of annoying things to deal with is practically endless, Aww. I am totally free in the Arataki gang. Strolling Are around you? the streets, roasting lavender melons with friends in the open country. I know it sounds pretty silly, but that's the life that I want. I get that. Just don't laugh at me, okay? Otherwise, you might find yourself on the receiving end of a good beating. Girl, I would never. I swear. Never, ever. Not for that, at it's least. It's hard to believe what we've encountered. What do we do from here? You don't look very well. At least not like when we just arrived. Are you troubled by what you saw behind the door? I think she is. Poor Lumi. Listen to me. 
The most important thing is always the choices you have in front of you. Get some rest before you gather the courage once you've oh, chosen the path sorry. to take. Don't hesitate. You must believe in your decision. Damn, Cookie's such a good girl. It's hard to believe what we've been doing. All right, you should get some rest too. <laughs> Look, they're really vibing, the three of them. That is so cute. Oh, that was... Never mind. What is this for? Look at them. Ushi, you sure you can't find a way back to that door again? About the door. Ah, perfect timing. I was just having a chat with Ushi about that. You know what? I can handle those mm -hmm. mean people behind the door throwing beans at me, but causing trouble for you? Nah, -uh. that ain't gonna fly with this guy. Aww. See, <laughs> sometimes Ido is really cool. What? There's nothing we can do. <sighs> Listen here, B. You shouldn't give up so easily. Can't you have one last look for it? If you really can't find it, we'll just have to find another door. With any luck, one that connects to the outside world. <laughs> mm, you feel me? Max Fiddleman, ladies and gentlemen. Anyways, uh... Way, traveler, if you have a moment, could you do me a favor? I'd like to discuss something with you. Oh, sure, yeah, uh... Ushi, you sure you can't find a way back... Yep, that's the big question. Gotta be honest, I have a no idea. Oh, come on, don't get mad at me. I'm just being real here. I did think about just using my own super strength to dig our way out, but the rocks here are even tougher than prison walls. The rocks didn't even budge when Ushi charged him. It's pretty obvious this place is meant to keep us in here. The only thing I can do now is, uh, well, take care of this exhausted little lavender melon. Aww. I'm on sleeping. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're helping too, Ushi. Yeah, and you're dancing, all right. So right, Ushi dance. Very cool. <sighs> Guys, I'm going to be back. I just need to grab something to eat. I can't think straight. <laughs> be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Thanks for giving me a minute. All right. Um, I know we. I said I wanted to do the domain thrift first, but if Yanfei says we need to come somewhere, we're, we're going. Thanks for coming to speak with me, traveler. Anything for you, babe? I've been thinking about this place. Since we still don't know just what kind of danger we're up against, we can't afford to delay any longer. We have to find the Conqueror of Demons as soon as possible. That's just what I was thinking. Don't you think it's a strange coincidence that as soon as you told us about the Conqueror of Demons, we heard his voice in that place? It almost seems deliberate. As if something was trying to convince us that the Conqueror of Demons was there in order to lure us into the unknown. I have a theory, but I can't tell the others just yet. I don't want anyone to panic. Judging from the Conqueror of Demons' reactions, I think that he was somewhere else. But his voice and image were projected to our location. Is it possible that we've entered into a chaotic space? Chaotic? What do you mean? We're seeing things and people that shouldn't be here. Even ghosts. And we don't feel hungry because the state of our bodies is suspended. It's as if time itself has stopped for us. Hmm. If that's true, it means we've entered into a place where normal logic doesn't apply. When you put it all together, everything points towards one possibility. This is a place where time and space are thrown into chaos. Damn. Big brain strats. We love to see it, babe. Okay. So, when we saw him at the domain entrance, he didn't really go the same way as us. And yet, if it's truly chaotic, how did we find our friend's voice even when we had no idea where he was? It doesn't make any sense. Unless this space wanted us to hear it. Which brings me to my next point. I also have a theory about our encounter with the Conqueror of Demons earlier. I submit that we didn't actually see the Conqueror of Demons. He was somewhere else. But his status was transmitted to us through... A, some kind of mind-bending spatial alteration. Wow, I feel like this is important pieces of the lore. Traveler, you said you saw the abyss in that room, didn't you? At first glance, that door may seem like a prank. It shows you whatever you're afraid of. But if it manages to lure you inside, there's no way of knowing what might be in there. One minute, it's playing a joke to get you to lower your guard. The next, the danger is real, and it's trapped you. No, I'm sorry. Wouldn't playing a joke, I mean, wouldn't offering you something nice and pleasant lower your guard? You seem to something that scares you, you're gonna, you're gonna put that guard up. I don't know. Don't really think that made a lot of sense, but okay. This space is a powerful opponent. It wants to use our minds against us. But I'm not going to sit here and do nothing. Do you remember that small spatial rift next to the dissolving ground? Yeah, I think so. It felt like spatial magic, but it seemed much more powerful than usual. When we saw that illusion of the Conqueror of Demons, it seemed like he wasn't expecting our spaces to intersect at all, and was even more surprised that we could hear and see him. I think that this space purposefully transmitted the Conqueror of Demons voice to lure us into a trap. But I also think it didn't count on that spatial rift happening. In other words, the fact that we saw and spoke with the Conqueror of Demons was never part of its plan. So that's why you were interrupted? Yes. Also, I had a good look around after coming back. I have a feeling that these chaotic spaces are constantly intersecting with each other, meaning that anything is possible. I think this gives us an opportunity. If the space creates phenomena meant to deceive us based on our imaginations, then we have to keep imagining, Traveler. Hmm. 
If you try to stay calm and listen carefully, maybe, just maybe, we'll hear the Conqueror of Demons' voice again. Damn, I really, really appreciate Mihoyo letting four stars shine like this in the story quests. Can you feel that? Let me see. I think it's here. Um, to my theory, Puzzle writes, love is scary despite my, uh, despite good intentions, I have defenses high. Yeah, it wasn't necessarily speaking about love, just pleasant things, you know? And... <gasps> So OP. <sighs> I secretly learned Yelan's illusion breaking method without her knowing. <laughs> really didn't expect that to work. That's my smart girl. The sound came from behind this illusion. Let's go in and take a look. Damn, Yanfei. By the way, I feel like the quality of the stream is really bad. It, ha it has been from the beginning. Is it alright or should I restart and hope that it's better. It's getting clearer. No. This is the chasm. <sighs> what did Bokish go through here? So. Just my daughter saw years ago. What is he doing here? Oh my girl. The voice is much clearer now. We're close. So. <gasps> it's a spiral rift. Conqueror of Demons, can you hear me? It's Yenfei. The Traveler and I are trying to find you. Xiao, are you there? Uh, traveler? Yenfei? It worked. Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. We heard the sounds of you fighting. What happened? Listen to me. It's chaotic here. We may not be in the same space. But sometimes the sound can get through, which means these separate spaces intersect from time to time. Everything is chaotic here. Find a way to get to us. No. Wow, helpful. <laughs> the darkness that sullies my soul is harmful to mortals. Oh, Xiao. Right now, we have more dangerous things to worry about than that. Also, like... This space is using our urge to find you to lure us into traps. At least half of the party isn't even immortal. Yenfei's not mortal. We're not mortal. Paimon's not mortal. Ito's not mortal. Without you here with us, <laughs> our search for you could very mortals. well lead us into danger. Without you here with us, our search... Please, come. So, you're in danger too? Yeah, babe. Uh, uh-oh. He said to... Ah! You! You revealed yourself, Shao. <sighs> We know. There's no need for you to search for me. Quality, uh, sorry. But we're worried about you. And earlier, the traveler was tricked into entering a dangerous place. Exactly. <sighs> How do we meet? Conqueror of demons, can you find out where our voices are coming from? Find the spot where our voices are the clearest and try something there. <laughs> it might work. <laughs> Great. <laughs> I see. The spaces may intersect amidst the chaos. By try something, do you mean- Oh, it's a secret she can't say, that's why- okay. Hurry! If we miss this chance, we might not get another one. What? What is that something? I want to know now. Bye, Shell. Stand back! <gasps> is it him? Yeah! <laughs> Very nice. <sighs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Let's get him back to the camp. Now 
we can avoid getting split up. Oh. Oh. Thank you. A lot's happened here, but this wasn't just for our own safety. You're injured. We can't just leave you alone. Exactly. It's just a flesh wound. I am fine. I shouldn't let myself be a burden to you. Chow, you need to learn to accept people's help. God dang it. You're not a burden. Don't think that for one second. We need you. All of us. For our sake. Please, stay here. Please? Fine. As you wish. You're injured. Get some rest. Everything else can wait. Yes, wait until you get better. <sighs> oh. Lumin is so worried for him. Xiao has closed his eyes and seems to be resting. Could he be dreaming? This is quite astonishing. Is a Yaksha who never lowers his guard capable of having dreams? Dang. Dang, 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 dang. Okay, um, so Yai Sakura writes that the stream is fine, but the audio's a little too sped up. So if you wouldn't mind, literally you don't have to do anything else. I'm going to shut the stream down and restart just now. Hopefully it will be better. I can't guarantee anything, but three hours in and of itself is a nice <laughs> point to stop and re-record. So yeah, you guys just chill here. I'm going to be back in like 30, 20 seconds. I don't know. See you then.